welcome back. Welcome back. What's going on, everyone? It's Abdallah here, bringing you guys another awesome Paper Mario Thousand Year Door live stream. We're going to be rocking Chapter 4 on today's episode. Thanks so much for coming. It's great to see all of you guys in the comments here. Thanks for, thanks for hanging out. So, I made one quick change. I noticed that in the previous three episodes, there was a lot of spoilers just running rampant. And, like, I want this to be a, a pseudo-blind playthrough, right? I played this 14 years ago. I don't remember anything about it. So, uh, we threw on members-only chat. So, if you guys want to jump in the chat, feel free to become a member. It's going to be awesome, and uh, I'm glad to have you guys on board with that one. So, anywho, uh, yeah, thanks for coming. Let's do it. I'm ready. I hope you guys are too. If you guys didn't already see on my main channel page, we got tons of, tons of Paper Mario content happening over here. So, keep in mind that we just finished off the Paper Mario on Nintendo 64. That was about eight episodes. Really fun. About two hours a pop. And then now we're jumping into Thousand Year Door. Next up is going to be Super Paper Mario and then Sticker Star. And then, of course, the uh, Color Splash. And then... The Origami King. We're going to do a 100% walkthrough of that one. It's going to be so amazing. So, I'm glad to have you guys on board. Thanks so much for being here. 760,000 subscribers. Welcome. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the like button. And let's hit this. All right. Good to see you guys. Thanks for coming. Uh, Dudish is here. We got uh, Matthew Fire, Jamie Rock, Gemma Moonstone, Jay McLean, Malik. Uh, insert username here. Little Carrot Ming. What's going on, Dark Angel? Jessica. Hi. Uh, who else is here? Kim from Peachy Peak. Hello. Iron Cat Sawyer. Sawyer. Carly. Hello. Oscar, what's going on? And uh, H. Fenton, Ivory, Christina, hello. Good to see you guys. Hopefully everything is going good. Catherine Holt, uh, John Paul, uh, Jaton, all of you guys here. Hi. Hello. All right, let's do it. Okay. Now, I, I trust that our members aren't going to spoil things or try to give any hints too, right? <laughs> Thumbs up if we're, we're on the same page about that. Uh, Beldum, tell me, what good are you? You still haven't taken care of that Mario character. Well, yeah, sorry, but only because he's tougher than we thought at first. You do understand that we Exynos must, must open the door first, do you not? Mwihihi, all rest assured that I will definitely nail him next time. We have, prepo we have prepared a weapon that will bring him to a quick and certain end. I trust your words, though. I rapidly lose my patience. Uh, just leave it to us, sire. Uh, let's away, my lovelies. Marilyn, Vivian. Uh, uh. Okay, I was close. <laughs> Predicted the guh, uh, but it was actually a uh, guh, which is unfortunate, but what can you do? Alright, should we take a shower, guys? I haven't taken a shower in a couple chapters. Uh, no doubt about it, I'm officially bored. Those awful X things haven't been back to ask about the map. I wonder, is it safe? Oh my, that must be tech again. Shower time? Yeah. Although, tech can see exactly what goes on. Nobody will mind if I take a quick rinse. <laughs> tech will see it. Who left the toilet seat open? Not to be a fun time. Joe's mother. What's up, Joe's mother? What's going on? Joe's mother's like, yo, I gotta get on on this member chat. Everyone welcome Joe's. Yo, you know Joe? Oh, dude, I know about Joe. Yeah, yeah. What's up, Joe? Alright, Joe's mother just in time for the shower scene. <laughs> Such a weird... Why would they program this in the game? It's so weird. Look at that beautiful hair, though. Like, that's the coolest hair ever. Like, putting her hair up like that looks great. And then the next thing you know, the hair is straight down again. Like, what? Come on, let me have hair up, Peach. Alright, Tech. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> you always call me in without warning, Tech. What is it this time? Are we gonna dance again? You're gonna be creepy? I apologize. I would like you uh, to go where Sir Grotus is and ask him something. What? What do you mean, go ask? 
I recently obtained specific information that brought an issue to my attention. You are the main computer here, right? Why is there anything you don't know? I'm unable to know things that are not entered into my CPU or otherwise recorded. Hey, Joe's mother, I'm glad to have you. I don't know your actual name, though. If you want to... <laughs> I don't want to refer to you as Joe's mother, but hey, whatever. To each their own. I'm so glad to have you. Thank you so much for coming. Uh, but even, if I try to go see him, they'll catch me and send me back to the room. That is true, but you will find a soldier's room one floor up. Take the elevator. Once there, obtain a soldier's uniform and change into it, avoiding detection. You will go see Sir Grotus looking like a soldier. You mean I'll be disguised? Oh, she's like, I already did that in my previous adventure. What's up, wicked clown smile? Hey, I imagine you won't take no for an answer, will you? Hey, wicked clown smile and Gabriel Batista. Hey, what's going on? Welcome. We got a little member train here. Thanks so much for coming. Let's uh, welcome all of our brand new members with the Mario emotes, the Paper Mario emotes. A whole bunch of them. All right. So judging from this, we have to go upstairs and we have to become a uh, uh, some sort of disguise. But let's just jump in and see where it takes us. Dang, that's a lot of Paper Mario, I see. It's a whole flood of Paper Marios. That's right, member train. Who's next? Oh, dang, going slap happy. Hey, welcome. Please wait a moment. There are, just, there are currently soldiers in the vicinity. Huh? Going slap happy. Hey, that's a, that's a pretty cool username. Okay, so I have to do something with the lamp? I don't know what. Disassembling something? Oh, gosh. I'm just gonna move on. Anyway, welcome, going slap happy. Welcome to it. Please change here, quickly. The soldier's uniform should be in a locker. Oh man, that locker door just swung right open. Hey! Huh, oh, is this a uniform? Am I supposed to wear this ugly thing? Yes, that's correct. Anything else in the other ones? One does not simply check for a badge. All right, Princess Peach in the changing room. Oh no. Oh, Tack, avert your eyes. <clears throat> I don't know about this. It's awfully tight and kind of smells a bit. Whew. Who knows how, but I got into it. I can barely breathe though. What is she gonna look like? What? No, I, that doesn't make any sense. Okay, hold on. I bet I look perfect. Absolutely not. There are no clothes in here. It must be somewhere else. All right. This is not... This is not happening. And the chat is not going to be released. Sorry, man. I gave the chat three live streams of streaming without spoilers, and we can't do it. Not right now. Sorry. Excuse me. Sir Grotus. <clears throat> yes, what is it? Speak. Oh, uh, well, it's about Princess Peach. What do you plan to do with her going forward? Hmm, something is wrong with your voice, x Not. Go. Perhaps I have a throat... Perhaps I have a throat lozenge. No, well, never mind. What about Princess Peach? I have no interest in what that woman has to say. Just keep her locked in the room. But don't ever, ever treat her roughly, you understand? Tell the others as well. But, uh, why in the world are we keeping her here, then? That's none of your business. Don't forget your place, you impudent worm. Concentrate on getting the legendary treasure. That's all I require of you. We x knots need that treasure to conquer the world. Don't forget it. Conquer the world? Legendary treasure? What are you blathering about now? Hmm, something is odd about you. No, 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 nothing odd. Uh, so Roger or whatever, uh, please excuse me. She's gonna get caught. She's gonna get caught. Oh, that was unnerving. All that stuff about conquering the world. Talk about creepy. I wonder if that has anything to do with collecting those crystal stars. Uh-huh. I'm afraid I can't allow you to exit uh, in that, princess. Please change into the dress. <laughs> oh, off with this thing. No way. Whew! Good old pink dress, my favorite. Why would I ever wear anything different? I better get back quickly. How did she become short, though? Are you guys as confused as I am about that? Like, that doesn't make sense to me. 
Tech, you terrible machine. So your goal is to conquer the world, is it? Of course, after all, I was built for that purpose. Conquering the world, how could you? Princess Peach, allow me to ask you something. Do you like the world you live in? There are many problems in the world, many sorrows. Do you like such a world? Of course I do. Nobody likes everything about the world, but I would love the good parts. But I do love the good parts. Uh, sure, there are many sorrows, uh, but there's also joy. Is that so? Tell me, will the crystal stars help you conquer the world? And what's this treasure? I'm afraid I cannot answer. Answering those questions is prohibited by Sir Grotus. Well, but... Oh, never mind. I must at least inform Mario about this awful plan for world domination. You guys ready for this? 10,000 words per minute. Count it. Alright, calculate this, right? Some of you guys like calculating the math of words per minute and the timing. Let's take a look over here. 1, 1,000. 2, 1,000. 3... Oh, that's... Hold on. That was two... Not even two seconds. We'll take a look when we see this email. Not even two seconds of her typing. Oh my gosh. Which of you members have done the, uh... <laughs> which one of you guys have done the, uh, the actual math? No way. It was three seconds? Okay. Um, actually. Alright. Well, why don't you give me the milliseconds? Down to the milliseconds, then. Let's do that. <laughs> um, actually, it was three seconds? Well, um, actually, it was like 2.975 seconds. What about that? Uh, that thing's humongous, everybody. Hide now. Save yourselves. Stupid cheating Mario. Who would have thought that fool would be in Glitzville? Uh, did you say something, your rudeness? Uh, no, nothing at all, as far as you know. Hey, did you see those little bite-sized shrimps? What were those things? <laughs> those are some punies. One of them should know about the Crystal Star. They fear you, so they're all hiding. Let's find them all and get the info we need. Okay, yes! Uh, look, I'm actually here invading the tree. Y -y Yikes, this guy's big and bad. He's large and in charge. Oh, you bet I am. Eek! You're scary, Mr. Giant Bad Breath Monster. Don't worry, Petuni. Your big brother's here. Well, we'll get through this. Whee! Oh, this is awesome. I did not expect Bowser to be in this. Can Bowser go in the pipes? Be gone! Whoa! The grandma! Yo, Bowser versus the grandma? Bowser would destroy this grandma. You're one of them, aren't you? One of the evildoers. You want our crystal star. Ah, see, I knew it. The ugly thing knows where the crystal star is. Tell us. How rude. Ugly thing? How dare you, you wretched crone? I'm the great puny elder. Eep, my heart. Don't start on me like that. I'm too old for this stuff. You're both too old. <laughs> it's hag versus hag. Awesome. <laughs> wow, he's actually thinking what I'm thinking. Me and Bowser are so alike. <clears throat> um, yeah, uh, Lord Bowser, you look as if you're just dying to say something. Uh, nope, nothing. Come on, dude, just say it, you know. Let's move on, shall we? You, Elder Hag thing, where's the Crystal Star? And don't try pulling rank again. Your answer, not your age, will determine your fate. Huh, Hag thing? Honestly. In any case, you're too late. The Crystal Star is gone. Oh, uh, what? That's right, you rude thing. We gave it to a mustachioed man named Marty O. He said he was collecting legendary treasures to rescue some princess. Uh, what did he call her? Princess Pinch? Yep. He was off to save that lucky lass. Princess Pinch. Oh, it's Mario. Not Mardio. And it's not Princess Pinch. Her name is Princess Peach. Who does that who does Cammy sound like in the comments? Dang. <laughs> but your senility is besides the point. <laughs> and treasures must be connected. Uh, Mario's trying to get it all. Treasures, princesses, does his greed never end? That jackal, both Princess Peach and the Crystal Stars belong to me. To me! If I find him, I'm going to finish him off once and for all, I swear it. That was good. 
So that was nice, a little interlude. You get to play as Bowser for five seconds, and then you get to find all the punies. Please, let me get back to all of this fun stuff. You know what I'm gonna miss if the chat is not freed? I'm gonna miss all of you guys at home asking for me to level up HP. That's what I'm seriously gonna miss. Because all my members know I'm not ever gonna level up HP, so... <laughs> I'm gonna miss that. So now you must leave. I understand. Uh, if you must, you must. We won't delay you. I hope you succeed in finding the rest of the crystal stars. Good luck. Gonzalez, I want to tell you, Rock Hawk ain't gonna fight dirty anymore. I'm gonna hit the weights, take some vitamins, and win the title fair and square. And I'm never ever gonna lose again. Remember, when life rocks you, rock back! Listen, G-Money, thanks for everything, man. You're the nicest dude I've ever met, and if you ever need it, I got your back. Me, I think I'm gonna chill here and improve my skills. King K's back, baby! And it's all thanks to you, dog. You're my boy, Mario! Dang. Now that Grubba's out of the picture, I'm gonna take over running the Glitz Pit. If you ever decide to run to the ring, just come back. I'll keep your spot open. You have tons of fans, and they'd absolutely love it if you made a comeback. Anyway, think it over, okay? And travel safe. Can you guys hear Rocco in the background? Uh, yeah, we still- we have crystal- we have three crystal stars now. We're rolling. Let's head back to Rogueport. Yeah, let's. Although, I kind of want to pick up some hot dogs, man. Those hot dogs are good items. Okay, you guys heard Rocco. Good, good, good. Alright. Okay, so I love hot dogs for starters. Because it's good FP and it's good, uh... Yeah, let's get some more pork hot dogs. And it's only 10 coins. It's like, it's arguably better. I'll buy one more. Okay, here, I'm gonna sell some stuff. I don't need the Courage Shell, that's two coins. And um, what else do I not need? I don't need... Uh, I could go for some honey, but this person doesn't sell any honey, so we're out of here. Look at that cool poster in the back, though. Did you see that? Pretty cool. Oh, yeah, give me that! I saw that glistening in the corner. I saw that glistening. Oh, dang! How are we getting that, though? No. I don't have- No, there's no way I can get that yet until I get, the, like, the super jump. I'll take that, though! An in coupon? No, I don't need that. That was good. All right, let me go deposit this in coupon, and then we're gonna go back to Rogueport. Yo, I got I got all these all beef hot dogs, right? Because we don't eat pork in this household. <laughs> we're not about that pork life. None of that pork. I'm out of here. All right, cheap cheap blimp. Let's go back home. Dun -dun 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 Gelatin in a salad? What? Who puts gelatin in a salad? Weird. <laughs> no pork at all. I mean, it is a pig. I don't think a pig is going to be serving pork hot dogs. But that's the thing too, like when you get offered a hot dog, people who are conscious about not eating pork, the first thing that goes in their mind is, alright, what kind of hot dog is it? Is that a beef hot dog? Is that a beef mixture hot dog? Like what is it? Or if you're big brain, you just stay away from hot dogs in general so you don't have to ask those hard questions, right? And then the answer is like, oh, I don't know, like if you go to like a ball game, and unless it shows like 100% Vienna beef, whatever. And you're just, you just ask the, the ball game seller of like, what meat is inside that hot dog? I would say 50% of the time, they wouldn't know. Anyway, here we go. Remember the WPM, right? Dearest Mario, I've uncovered something terrible. These things, the x knots they're planning to take control of the world. It's to that end that they're searching for the crystal stars. I still don't know what the crystal stars do, but you must try to get them all. I will gather what information I can, Princess Peach. 
What? They want to rule the world? That does not sound like a friendly plan. Okay, well, that's cool. But, uh, yeah, we're getting out of here. Did we get a new ability? We did! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. We did get a new ability. The ability to fly on top of a small child. Whee! Oh! Dang it. I gotta try that again. <laughs> I gotta try that again real quick. Yeah, someone's gotta count the words, man. Count how many words that was. And then actually go back. Count how many frames. Oh, dude, Luigi's here! Oh my gosh, Luigi's here. Guys, should we find out what happened to Luigi in the Pudding Kingdom? And Princess Eclair, the non-existent? What? Shino Spriteuro! Here we go. Yoink. Nope, that doesn't work. What is this? To Twilight Town? Uh, maybe I'm, I'm a little too early for this. What, some of you guys actually like Luigi's made-up stories? <laughs> maybe a little bit later. Let's, uh, let's see what's going on. Can I go this way? I could have sworn I could have. In order to see the thousand year door, you can't? Because I don't have Admiral Bobbery or whatever? That's unfortunate. Wait, do any have any of you guys paid attention to see if uh Mer Lovely's spell is still on me? Oh dang, see that's the one thing that um that I do want to find out. Oof. And that's what I love from regular chat, too. Regular chat is on top of knowing that information. Hmm. Ground pound and gulp? Oh, gosh. Um, yeah, you're not gonna do any of that stuff. How about you just do... You can just appeal. Oh! <laughs> What's up, KV? Hey, KV to you! Hello, welcome. That's a fire flower. Fire flower tier membership, welcome. I'm so glad to have you. KV, what's the KV stand for? Okay, we were just talking about Mer Lovely. Now we're gonna get all that big money. What's up, KV? KV to me. How can we tell the spell's gone? It says, um... It says it after its usage. Like, it'll say, like, as soon as, oh my gosh, as soon as it, as it uses it, it'll say, the spell is worn off, or something like that. I haven't experienced it in TTYD, but if it's the same thing as the previous Paper Mario, then that's kind of what we're thinking. So we'll just have to pay extra close attention. Oh, I can't touch this still. Ugh, come on, man. Alright. So, I do also have to ask some of you guys that have been paying attention. Where else have we seen... The gigantic yellow blocks. This is the pit of a thousand trials, right? We don't have to deal that deal with that right now. Where else have we seen giant yellow blocks? Because I've seen right now two giant stone blocks. Yeah, I remember. I haven't been paying attention. <laughs> this is what I rely on <laughs> open chat for. <laughs> hey, what's up, KV? Welcome, welcome. It's pretty much your initials. Got it. All right, I'm going to guess right now. You have to tell me if I get it right. Kimberly? V Villanueva. Villanueva. Kim. Kimberly. Kenny. Kent. <laughs> <laughs> Jessica, hey, I'm glad to have you. Alright, so we found something. <laughs> Why? Come on, there's only like 5k names. Catherine, that's a good one. You don't have to say if we're right. 
<laughs> Kimberly Villanueva. All right, hey, that shows where the fourth crystal star is. Can't frankly guy read it? That'd be cool, but first we better tell him that what Princess email, uh, Princess Peach's email said. Yeah, let's do that. Kirsten, Kirsten Vardaman, you just changed your name instead of KV. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> KV changed her, her U, the YouTube username and avatar to an actual name to be just like Kirsten. Anyway, the group that kidnapped Princess Pete is uh, bent on total world conquest. Oh, you got that right. That's why those jerks need that legendary treasure. Hmm, this doesn't bode well. The situation has gotten far more serious than I thought. Let me bring you up to speed. Uh, I've been researching just what this treasure could be. One book I came across held to what I thought was a preposterous theory. This book claimed that the treasure was, in actuality, the Great Cataclysm. The very cataclysm that a thousand years ago sank that uh, town underground. So these jerks think the power of that cataclysm will help them rule the world? I can't say for sure what they'll do or why, but we must consider the possibility. Now that things have come to this, we mustn't let them near the legendary treasure. That's all that matters, because if they do get it, then once again, this town, no, the entire world could be destroyed. Then out with it, prof. We gotta find that next crystal star super quick. Huh, according to the map, it appears next to the crystal star is in Twilight Town. We found the entrance to it. Twilight Town. Uh, to tell you the truth, I don't know much about the place myself, only rumors. I've heard that, as the name implies, it's perpetually dim and eerie there. Wait just a moment. Aha, there appears to be a pipe to Twilight Town somewhere here in Rogueport. I do believe it's somewhere underneath the west part of town. Yes, definitely. If you get stuck for any reason, just come back and see me again, okay? Under the ground, the west part of town. Gotcha, Professor. Come on, Gonzalez. Let's go. Time to break out. Okay. This is good. Oh, here's an email. That I'm not going to check. Hey, what's up, Josie Vaughn? Hey, what's going on? Welcome. So glad to have you. Josie Vaughn. What are you doing outside, Toddy? Oh, you got some badges, badge boy? Booze sheet. <laughs> My gosh. That's some real boo sheet right there. Wow. Oh my gosh, that's actually funny. Booze sheet. That's, you understand that that's the writing staff slipping one in underneath the radar, right? Please tell me you understand that. Hey, welcome, Josie. Thanks so much. Let's go listen to Luigi since some of you guys like this. Well, I got my second piece of The Marvelous Compass at Plump Belly Village recently. Oh boy, I really got my hands dirty on that one, I'll tell you what. It was pretty wild, bro. Want to hear what happened? It's a pretty long story. Hey, sounds good to me. Which part of my story you want to hear, broski? Let's let's learn about this. And who's this bomb? Right? Is this bomb at 2.0? Well, like I said, it's a really long story, but here it goes. Once we made landfall on the Strudel continent, uh, we made for Plump Belly Village. Once we got there, though, we immediately noticed that something was wrong. We learned from the mayor that the town was ruled by a giant snake named Hizza. Oh, yeah. He said his own daughter was going to be offered up as a sacrifice to this beast, too. So, of course, being heroic, I offered myself up to go in her stead. Brave, huh? Now, the custom was for sacrifices to be dressed as brides, so I got all dolled up. I was one hot sacrifice, bro. I looked so good, I fooled our foes and got in Hizza's lair. Oh gosh. It was kind of rough fighting in that gown, but I managed. Chiffon really chafes, bro. Ugh. I finally found Hizza, and the snake had a second head on its tail. Talk about scary. I fainted real quick, but when I came to, I managed to distract both heads. It reared up, fangs bared to attack, and at that moment, I deftly lunged left. His gaping mouth smashed into one another, and he vanished in a cloud of smoke. A shining plate fell down in the spot where Hizza's body had been coiled. Yes, another compass piece. I set it, and it pointed east to Circuit Break Island. Just as I was about to leave the town, the mayor asked me to stay and marry his daughter. I thought about it. She was sort of cute. But we ended up sneaking off the next morning. 
I mean, I still have to save Princess Eclair from the Chestnut King. <laughs> hey, what's up, Blue Eyes Angel? What's going on? I can see your eyes through the internet right now, and they are very blue. Welcome. Thanks so much for coming. So it's good. So, Luigi, uh, the compass activated this time and I heard someone's voice. It was so beautiful, bro. I'm certain it was the Princess Eclair's voice. My heart began to raise. That's when I realized that Princess Eclair, I think I... Oh, I kind of zoned out there. Uh, so yeah, we set sail again after ditching town. And somehow we managed to get back here to Rogueport. And here I am. Okay. How much of that are you guys believing? Hi, I guess. I'm Jerry. I'm a bob -omb from Plump Belly Village. Nice meeting you. Sorry I sound so down, but... Uh, you would be too if you saw Luigi dressed as a bride. I'm serious, it scarred me. It was honestly scarier than that giant snake thing. I feel I now have a moral duty to stop Luigi from ever dressing as a bride again. I have to protect the world from my fate. That's why I'm sticking close to this guy. So maybe there is some truth. Maybe there's some truth to his stories. What do you guys think? The bob -omb named Jerry though. What you know about Jerry? All right, so I'm gonna go this way because I want to backtrack a little bit. Uh, was that Josie? Was that something about the? <laughs> was the spell wearing off? Did I uh, did I see that? I don't mind buying another one. The badge shop is on the top of the item shop in Rockport. I will go there right now. Thank. That's a good, that's a good tip. What I don't remember, though, I don't remember where Mer Lovely is. Pokemon Anime Battle, thank you. Welcome. I think this is where Mer Lovely is, so I'm gonna give this a shot. I don't mind dropping 50 coins. Even if it's not, like, done, we'll just do it. We got money, but I need to go buy some badges, though. Okay, Pokemon Anime Battle, thank you. And then I also was gonna explore around town for the badge shop. I've never really messed around with the badge shop yet because I really didn't have badge points or anything like that. So I'm gonna make sure I do that today. So thanks for reminding me on that. Hi, your real name is Camille. All right, cool. I love the name Camille, it's a great name. I used to have a friend named Camilla. What happened to Camilla? I used to have a friend. <laughs> Whenever I start those stories, they're actually hilarious. All right, let's go over here. Have to go. It was nice meeting everyone. Hey, thank you so much. Thanks for hanging out. Make sure you watch the rest of the stream once it loads up. Yo, he keeps on going for a dip. All right, bad shop on the upstairs. The end. Thank you. That's cool. I'm gonna. I'm on my way over there, Jacqueline. I'm on my way. Here we go. All right, you ready to fly, boy? Forget jumping, man. When you got a little Enzo like this, you might as well go. All right, so nothing that way. That was pretty good. Nothing that way. We got our Mer Lovely spell back. I think I want to try this place really quick. So right now what I'm looking for is I'm looking for the large yellow blocks. I'm looking for the large yellow blocks that I could do a spin hammer attack with. Just in case there's any, like, floating around over here. Like this one. Exactly. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look at this. Look at this. Shine Sprite. And then that opens that. So this gives me two shortcuts to two areas of the map where I've previously been through. So I do want to find out uh, some really shortcuts over here. See where it takes me. Jump in. Just to see what's up. Okay, this takes me over to Koopa Town. Hey, what's up, Koops? Yo, there's uh, Lacky Lulu. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. 
Dun, dun, dun. Lacky Lulu equivalent. That's the only... I don't honestly remember her name. You guys remember her name? The Koopa? The Koopa girl? Okay, and look at this wall. Look at this badge. Dang. Was this the flower FP plus that I totally didn't need in the previous episode? Dang, man. Dang. FP plus. I don't need it. It's too expensive. FP plus is three. Although, maybe I could use it. What do I want to sack? Um, I don't need partner charge. I can use... You know what? That's actually good. I get rid of partner charge. I like last stand. I need that in my life. Uh, damage dodge I need. Quake hammer I need. Uh, happy heart I... Mm, happy heart helps out. It's pretty clutch sometimes. But I don't need it need it. For more FP. You know what? I'm okay for now. I'm okay with 10. The next level up that I get, which is going to be in 2 seconds, I'll put that on. That was good. Yeah, what was her name? Koopy? Koopy Koo? Yeah, yeah, serious. Got it. Koopy Koo. That's exactly it. Oh, so what I like about this is that this is like a, a hallway with all the warps. That's just conveniently located. And you don't have to worry about remembering if it's upstairs, downstairs, or the other. So that's really cool. Alright, let's go down here. Koopy Koo. Koopy. Oh, dang, another one. Sweet. Yo, this backtracking is awesome. Hey, we'll take that. How many star pieces do I currently have in inventory? I need 15. I have six. Okay, not bad. Huh. I have not sprung. All the way up here for some paper plane action. Let's see what it does. What? What is the point of this? Oh, dang! Yeah? How many shine sprites do I have? I have four! Guys, it's time to level up someone. Who's worth it, though? Who would you guys level up? Let me know in the comments. Flurry, right? Obviously. There's only one right answer. It's Mama Flurry. We would only level up Mama Flurry. Am I right? There's only one right answer. I don't know if I like Engerman. Well, I love Engerman in real life, but I don't really like his... What? What's his ability when he gets to level 2? Or maybe I should just save him. Until I get ultra ranking and then just go all in on uh, Goombella. Great. What? Oh, okay. Alright, let's get out of here. Enzo has the egg throw. Okay, okay. Well, I like egg throw. Is that kind of like paracarry? Alright, alright. Let's get Enzo going. So, I gotta get out of here. I gotta go to the top. Oh my gosh, that last chapter was such a doozy. Man. Doola 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 doola. Okay. Enzo is gonna help us out. It's only the natural progression, right? You gotta level up your characters, even if you don't plan on using them. <laughs> That's a misclick! Not flurry! <laughs> oh my gosh. Shazubi, baby. Alright, let's go. Yeah, Enzo is one of my cats. Yeah, he's, uh, he's a little gray cat. He sometimes jumps up here and says hello. Uh, so yeah, he's really good. Love Enderman. 
All right, I kind of want to take a nap, but I think I'm going to be okay. The next battle that I get into, I'll just use my little star power and then I win. But I did want to go over here to the badge shop. It's on top of the inn, yeah? Some of you guys said it's up here, but I need to go shopping. So where up here? It's on top of the inn. Oh, like actually physically on top? Not, not go in. Oh, what? Yo, my big old head was in the way. Oh yeah, yo badge time. Oh, what do we got, what do we got? Power rush, super appeal, first attack, close, close call. No, thank you. How do you, okay, pretty lucky, nope. Power rush, when Mario, oh, I like power rush. Increases Mario's attack by two when Mario is in danger? Yes, please. 35 coins for power rush, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, may I have that, thank you. How do you, how do you get more badges to cycle through? What can I do for you? I'm buying. What kind of badges? Uh, special deals. Okay, you're looking for special deals. Find them on the shelf. Otherwise, stand in front and press A. Why would you tell me this? I'm selling. Oh, you can sell your badges? That's kind of cool. So, like, things that I'll never use, like these stupid sound effects ones. I could sell for money. That's interesting. Okay, welcome, welcome. Feel free to look around. You kind of look like Ms. Mao's, don't you? Interesting. So, let's see. Yeah, I want that badge on me, man. Mario's power goes so high. <laughs> yes, man. Alright, here we go. Check this out. Talk about hyper-offensive. We don't need happy heart. When we can do... What was it called? Mega Rush? Power Rush. No, I'm sorry. I'll take Power Rush, but I'll also put on um, Happy Heart. This is fine. What? What's over here? Why would they do this? Oh, so you can go behind here. Gumbabwe. Alright, um, maybe there's something else up there. Yeah, I like this concept. But I do want to see how I... Okay, so maybe it's like two screens? Maybe you have to go two screens in order for them to replenish their badge? Let me go two screens and then we'll see what's up. There was um, a little bit of... There was a little bit... Of in the original Paper Mario, where you went two screens and then they changed their shop items. So let's see what's up. Burn up, burn up. Leaving Rogue Port and re-entering cycles the bad shop. Oh, okay. So even if I just went two screens, that's not enough. Let's find out. So if I go into like another town, like Koopa Town or whatever, Petalburg. Well, it seems that two screens worked. Ice Smash, Last Stand, oh, beautiful. That's what I want, thank you. That's what I wanted. Uh, piercing Blow, Power Rush, Shrink Stomp, Power Rush. Yeah, that worked out wonderfully. I just need one more. Damage dodge, charge, quake, hammer, mega rush. Uh, I don't think I need happy heart. Power bounce is a killer though. Close call. When Mario's in danger, sometimes causes enemy to miss. I like that. Uh, I can get rid of happy heart in order to put on last stand. Yeah, this is a wonderful thing. If I can nail one more last stand badge for my last badge point, you bet. You better believe. What were you talking about? Like a star piece on the roof. Am I missing something here? What are we talking about? Get over here. 
All right, here we go. Let me try one more time. I, I have to be completely blind as to what you guys are saying. Oh, just chilling right here on top? What? How are you supposed to see that? Weird. Oh, maybe when this thing rotated? Interesting. Hmm. Alright, let's move on. I don't have time for that. Um, so, yeah, it looks like from what I saw from that bad shop, I went two screens, and then it refreshed. So let me try if one screen refreshes it. If that's the case, then I just want another one of those last stand badges. Two screens, wow, look at that. It's true. It's true to Paper Mario, um, the original game. Can you believe it? The original game was like, yeah, you gotta go two screens in order for the bad shop to refresh, so... It's not necessarily leaving Rogueport. That's cool. That's really cool. Dude, we're already 46 minutes into this, and I haven't done a single thing towards the next chapter. Not a single thing towards the next chapter. I just, I just want to land this. I want to land it so bad. Close call P? No. Super appeal? Pretty lucky. First attack, shrink stomp, close call P. No, um, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna try like maybe two more cycles and then if we don't get it, we don't get it. I have one badge point right now that's just kind of like waiting for another last stand or another like power rush, something like that. And then at the same time, I don't honestly know, I can't confirm whether or not you could buy multiples of the same badge. So that's what I'm kind of banking on. So we'll do a couple more cycles and see what we get. But if we don't get it, then the show the show must move on, right? Oh dang, you got some flower one, huh? Sleepy stomp, happy flower, power jump, no, ice smash, and pretty lucky P. I like that they're like all like changing out. This is great. We got some pretty interesting ones, but no, I got my I got my heart set on certain badges for this specific run. All right, come on, Ouija time. There we go. Beautiful. That's exactly it. That's exactly it. How beautiful. How beautiful was that? Okay, so I got two last stands on. So I was able to buy two last stands, which is awesome. I could honestly go for one more. I want one more. 
Last stand's amazing. Damage drop Mari receives uh, by half when he's in danger. I kind of want one more because I can get rid of last stand P because I don't need my partners to have last stand. Mega Rush sounds really awesome. Uh, and then what was another one? It was Power Rush. Like, if I can get another Power Rush? I'll try another couple times. Here we go. If you guys are down for that. I have at least a couple. Oh, we're going to find out if they stack. We're absolutely going to find out if they stack. Because look, if I have two last stand badges, that's like a quarter of the damage. And I'm out here rocking 10 HP, a quarter of the damage? Yo, Mario's going to be untouchable. Provided that they stack. So we're going to find out. We're going to find out here. If I can get one... E dude, even if I get like a power plus. For science, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we're gonna be awesome, man. Yo, forget buying HP, dude. It's all about badge points. Right? Remember that? Who said that? Ooh, what do we got? What do we got? A FP drain. Oh, drop Mara's attack power by one, but gain FP per attack. That's <laughs> pretty good. Ice smash, pretty lucky. Dang, dude, that's actually a really cool looking one. Gain one FP per attack? I mean, I don't know if I wanna buy it, but. Should I buy it? FP drain? Because I only have 10 FP, right? So if I can mitigate some of that by absorbing it per attack? That's really good. <laughs> I, I kind of want it. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, it sounds really amazing. All right, here, how, how much money do I have? Coins, 274. I don't think I'm, hold on, how many badge points? One badge point? Drain. I don't know, man. Buy it. You can always sell it. That's true. I can always sell it. Yes. You know what? That is a perfect, a perfect way of thinking about it. I can always sell it for half off. I like the concept of it. I don't like the concept of Mario getting like, um, I don't like him being weaker by one, but we do have we do have the power, whatever it was, that we got for one badge point. So for two badge points, you're going to net, get every single one hit gives you one flower point. That's good. But if I'm going hyper offensive, that probably won't be the best bet. Yeah, if I'm going for hyper offensive, it probably won't be the best. But I'll have it just in case I want to mess around with it. Doesn't hurt being prepared, absolutely. Especially if it's against like little minion enemies that I could just destroy. So I don't have to waste time using a little star casting. Sweet treat. Oh yeah, baby, give me this. Here it is, close call. Oh no, that's not the one. Dang it. Ah, this one is unsimplifier. Makes action commands hard, but earned more star power. No thanks. First attack, no thanks. I just don't really remember the uh, the icon, so I got excited for that one, but it's not it's not what I want. Close call's not what I want. Like you don't want to go like a Mario that's by chance gonna miss an attack whenever someone hits you. No, that's not worth it. That's more defensive than offensive. So wow, look at me just like trying for RNG over here. Trying to get, like, the good badges. I did not expect that. I hope there's a faster way. I don't know if there's a faster way of changing out the shop. We tried one uh, one screen, and then we've tried two screens, and two screens work, so... There we go. There we go. So oh, dang it. Power Rush P? No! I thought this one was it. <laughs> it, has to be, it has to be this, like, D-looking badge. Power Rush. When your ally is, uh, uh, -huh, uh -huh, but not close call. Super appeal. P piercing glow. I just want one more. Can a guy get one more? Like, that's it, man. What's the faster way to go through the badges? If you know. Uh, 
Oh, going back into the inn could be one, right? No, is that? You think that changes it? Maybe just not go all the way out? Pretty lucky. Power rush, close call. This is the one. No, I'm not. Hold on, so talk to him. Uh, I'm buying others. Oh, are you kidding me? Well, thank you. That's way better than refreshing the area. Give me these. But it's not the ones that I want. So do these change every time too? Oh man. Uh, first attack on simplifier, simplifier. Make action commands easy. Oh dang, that's actually really good. Action commands are hard. How many badge points? Yeah, sometimes I'm like missing action commands. So this is actually a good badge to have. I like that idea, but this has to change. Close call P. All right, so we're gonna find out. We're gonna find out just by leaving two areas to see if his pocket stash is a little bit uh, RNG related as well. Let's see. Yeah, that action command badge is actually really good. I should put that on right now because there are times where I'm just like missing inputs because of, you know, lag and whatever. Uh, so anyway, what's up, Cub Club? Yo, what up, Cub Club? Welcome, 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 welcome. Power plus P? No, I need that. I need last stand P. Sort methods, A, B, C, D. Last stand, this one goes away. I'm gonna do, um, what is it called? All simplify, yeah, it's called simplifier. Yeah, simplifier may be like a little crutch though. I kind of feel like it. We've been going okay without simplifier for the past three chapters, but there are times where I would waste a turn charging with Mario. And then the next turn I do my multi bounce or the super bounce and then I miss the inputs. So anyway, welcome Cub Club, welcome Roxas Uzumaki. Uh, what do we need here? I don't think this dude's gonna sell me the same stuff. Let's see. Oh yeah, he does. Doesn't he? Power Rush P, close call. Yeah, so it looks like, hold on, hold on, maybe not. Sleepy Stomp, piercing. Maybe he does or he doesn't. I don't know. I have to actually like snap a, a screenshot of this really quick to actually confirm or deny whether or not he does that. I don't need any of these things though. Shrink Stomp, first attack, unsimplifier, happy flower, power jump. Oh no, I don't need that. Lancey Lee, you got Julian today in Animal Crossing? What does that even mean? Like, who's Julian? Is he good? Is he, your, is he one of your dreamies? I don't know, I have no clue. All right, so we're about an hour an hour in. I'm kind of prepping these badge points right now because that's the strategy that I'm using throughout the entire game. So let's see. Let's see exactly what we have to do here. He's a blue unicorn guy. Interesting. Happy flower power jump. Does this guy sell any more? Yeah, he does the exact same. Th oh, no, no, he doesn't. He doesn't. It's slightly different. Shrink stomp. Piercing blow. Ice smash. Power rush. P close call. Pretty lucky. Oh, he does change. Yeah, he does change his, his wear. Is, it's ever so slightly. I don't need close call. I'm going to do this a couple more times. Power Rush P is cool, but no, we're not doing that. Oh, 
Unicorn with a Zodiac house. Julian, huh? His house is filled with all the Zodiac items, like a cloud house. Kind of cool, he's into astrology. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, give me some work now. Power Rush P. No, why did it have to be the P? Oh my gosh, super appeal. All right, so that has to be like the D. That's what I'm looking for. I'm buying others. Close call. I don't think he's going to sell me any, guys. What if... I, no, I was going to say, what if I just buy them all? But then, like, I won't have enough money to buy the other ones. All right, so let's just uh, do, like, three more. Last three. Last three, and then I'm out. Last three more tries. If we don't get it, then we don't get it. I'm okay. I think I kind of have a lot of them. Yeah, the race for Julian. Watch. The race for Julian. Oh my gosh, my stomach is going to be sick if I do that. Dude, there's just so many things wrong with those little mazes, man. I don't know. I'm a little burnt out of those. I'm still salty. Still very upset about my performance on the last one. Pretty lucky. Power jump. Close call P. Okay, nope. Give me some good stuff, guy. What else? What else? Power Rush P. No. These are not the ones I want. I want Power Rush regular. And I want Last Stand. You know what? Okay, last two and then I'm out. Trade Judy for Raymond. <laughs> Gotta get that Raymond. He doesn't belong to you because he belongs to me. <laughs> What's up, Cub Club? Yo, someone's got a birthday tomorrow. Who's got a birthday tomorrow? Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Someone's got a birthday tomorrow. <laughs> Krom, that's right. Krom's birthday is tomorrow. All right, here we go. Second to last try. Super appeal. <laughs> Bert. <laughs> you know what? I think there's got to be some sort of programming per chapter. Hey! Wait, no. Dang it. I keep on thinking that that's the one, but it's not. All right. Well, we're done. So I'm out. Okay, let's go. We're ready. I'm ready to do this chapter. You guys are ready to watch it. It's been an hour of me RNGing this, and I got two of the badges that I wanted. At least three. No, seriously, who the heck's birthday is tomorrow? Oh my gosh, wasted. Oh, oh. <laughs> someone's birthday tomorrow. What are we going to do to celebrate someone's birthday tomorrow? I don't know. You guys want to do anything special? Should we do anything special to celebrate someone's birthday tomorrow? Because someone was born tomorrow. Just in general, just generically speaking, someone was... B-O-R-N! Let's go. Ooh, someone was Bjorn. Alright, here we go! I gotta get Goombella out. Wait a second, what? The pipe rejected you? Excuse me! What? Do I need to be at full health? 
Do I have to use Flurry's good looks in order to, like, persuade them? What in the actual heck? Yo, blow on it. Yo, blow on these. Here we go. No? No? <laughs> yeah, it's... I gotta do something. I know I gotta do something, but... Alright, here we go, here we go. How about, Goombella, you spell it out for me, girlfriend. No spoilers yet. Here we go, here we go. We're down below Rogueport. There's a pipe here that connects to 12. Okay, thanks, Captain. <sighs> yeah, I, uh, my next train of thought would be to see exactly what was going on with... Um, with what's his, what's his goggles. To say, hey, heads up, I went in the pipe, but the pipe rejected me, so you need to tell me what else is going on. Yahoo. Don't talk to me. I need to go. Yeah, what's his goggles? That's his name. You know who I'm talking about. The old Goomba that praises Mario. He praises Mario, but yet somehow ignores the history of how Mario almost single-handedly eradicated the entire Goomba species. So, you're just gonna turn a blind eye to that? Alright, that's cool. You can't keep grudges. You can't keep grudges, right? Get on with your lives. Single-handedly eradicated an entire Goomba species in Mario 1, 2, 3, World, All-Stars. Hey, we found your pipe. That thing's all stopped up. We tried and tried, but we can't break through it. Got any drain cleaner? What? You can't get through the pipe, you say? How odd. Huh, I'm afraid I haven't the foggiest idea of what you should do. Oh, of course. I've heard that fellow from Twilight Town lives here in Rogueport. If anybody knows how to get through the pipe, it'll be him. His name was, uh, Dang. What was it? Ah, uh, yes, the lover of dark places. Darkly! I've seen him loitering right here in this part of town in the past. Look for Darkly. This part of town. Oh, this part of town. Darkly. Yo, Darkly, you in here? Locked from the inside. Darkly's right inside there, then. I'm coming, Darkly. Yo, you know where Darkly is? No, I don't think you know where Darkly is. Don't talk to me. You squirrel ant. Open the door. Let me out. Please let me out. Alright, I'm finding Darkly. Darkly... Oh, look at this! Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Can little boy fly me across? Fly me to the moon, boy. You got this? You got this? Can you make it? Bzzz, nope! Dang it. Uh, yes. Bzzz. Yep, there we go. Got him. Oh my gosh, how many of these do we have? Should we upgrade Flurry now? No, I got two. Dang. All right, Flurry. You know I'm never going to upgrade Flurry. How about that? All right, so that was great that we went back here. I'm... Oh, what in the world? Yeah, yeah, I don't think that's easy to get on the roof, though. So we're gonna have to figure out something. Hello, are you Darkly? Hey, is this your first time in the Trouble Center? If you plan on using your services, I'll explain them to you first. Yeah, I don't know what this is. Uh, listen, listen, good. A trouble Center is where people come with their troubles. That's why I named it that. Okay, so like little side quests if you want to do them. You're a nice guy, you'll choose someone and try to help them out. If not, not. Uh, help someone out and they'll probably give you a reward. Ah, not a big deal. Alright, anyway, you have to pay to cancel. Mm, I'm okay. Oh my gosh, wow. Look at all these people. No, not about that life, sorry. Yeah, not gonna happen. Mario's dead. I'm gonna die from hazards. 
I'm gonna die from hazards. Oh my gosh. That shouldn't- oh my goodness. That shouldn't be like that. Where was it? Oh, uh, there it is. Got it. Oh my, look at this. Yo, we got, we got enough to get Flurry going. We got, oh. Hey, who the heck are you? Guys. You wanna, how, you wanna know how to get through the pipe to Twilight Town? Couldn't be easier, you just have to have something that has your name written on it. Don't you have anything that has your name written on it? Come on, everyone does. Not really. Okay, hang on. I'll write it for you. What's your name? Mario, huh? Okay, I'll write it here on the seat of your overalls. Mario, right? Wait, on the seat of my overalls? Is he writing on my butt? I'll write it here on the seat of your overalls. M-A-R-I-O. There, perfect Amundo. While I'm at it, I'll write your partner's name too. What's your name? Enzo, baby. Baby Enzo! Oh, why are you writing on our butts, dude? Hey, watch where you're drawing, buddy. I don't know what errand uh, is uh, taking you to Twilight Town, but I hope it goes well. I'll be rooting for you. Okay, so for starters, how was I supposed to find this? Oh my gosh! What in the actual heck? Wow, dude. Yeah, right. How were we supposed to find that other than dumb luck landing on that? Okay. Interesting. Oh my gosh. That's crazy, man. All right, well, now that we have it, let's go. He wrote on our butt. That's like assault. How about you? You got something better for me, guy? Slog? <laughs> I don't need... Oh, the W emblem. Hold on, hold on. I'll buy the W emblem. 360? No thanks. I'm good. Highway robbery, you mustache dude. Alright, I'm a Luigi number one. Let's go, Enzo. Let's go, Enderman. Wow, you have to be like frame perfect with that. There's little to. There's no error on that. Alright, Enderman, let's go down. You got your name written on your butt, right? Good. Because that's where you need your name written. Chapter 3, 4. Dun 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 dun. Wow, an hour into this. That's the pregame show. Now let's do it. For pigs, the bell tolls. Pigs? Oh man, we all like pigs. Like Lil Oinks? <gasps> 3D pigs. Lil Loinks. Uh, this place gives me the creeps. Is this Twilight Town? Hey. It's been a long time since anyone come from outside. You've come from far away. Yeah, those clothes are yours. I'm pretty sure you guys must be adventurers, right? This is a bad time to arrive. Wait, but you're adventurers. Maybe it's the perfect time. Wait, what? A bad time? What do you mean by that? Come on, tell me. Oh, gee whiz, I don't know. It's a scary tale to hear, and scary to tell, too. Oh, no, the bell rang again. Oh, this is so awful. Who could it be now? Oink, oink. Oh, my gosh. Whoa, that's the craziest thing I've ever seen. What's going on with this weirdo town? Oh, badness. Now poor Freddy got turned into a pig. Not good. A pig with red eyes. Yikes, Freddy! Who are you, Gramps? <laughs> I'm the mayor of this poor town. Some call me Dor. Dower. Dour. Dor. Dower. 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 
Yeah, how are you guys gonna pronounce this dude's name? It's not Dor, it'll be D-O-O-R. I'm not exactly the sharpest fellow, but I do believe you're adventurers, right? This isn't the place for the telling of tales, sadly. Come, come to my home. Dior? Christian Dior? I don't think it's Dior. It could be Dior. Yeah, right, D apostrophe. O-U-R. Uh, my traveling friends, welcome to Twilight Town. Well, I'd like to welcome you, but welcoming people is generally a good thing, and it's nothing but bad here. As you may have guessed, our town has been cursed. Whoa, cursed. Yes, cursed. That's the right word, right? Yeah, of course it is. You see, beyond town is a forest, and in its heart is an ancient building, the Creepy Steeple. The dark creature who lives there, its curse ordains that when the steeple bell rings, one of the Twilighters living uh, here in the village becomes a pig. Will my loved ones become swine? Will I too become a curly-tailed oinker? I'm so worried I can't sleep at night, of course. Night and day are pretty similar here. If this keeps up, well, the village will be one giant pig pen, which would be bad. Let me give you some advice. Leave us. Leave us before you get too pigified. Not gonna happen, Gramps. We're looking for something really important. Maybe you've heard of it. It's a star-shaped rock called the Crystal Star. Uh, I don't know about anything Crystal Star thing, but in Creepy Steeple, there's a glittery red stone shaped like a star. Whoa, are you serious? That's gotta be the Crystal Star. Gotta be. Uh, you people. You aren't thinking of going to the Creepy Steeple, are you? Brr, unthinkable. Yeah, well, I'm going to jump on your things and take your stuff. Well, I'll go to the creepy steeple. Let me change my partner, though. And I could really use a healer. I need a healer. What's up? Look at these pigs. Bazoink. Don't talk to me. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Little pumpkins. Oh, I could I could totally use a little rest here, but I'm not about, I'm not about to pay for one. You, don't get turned into a pig. Will it feel weird to turn into a pig? Do pigs feel stuff? I'm not looking forward to this. Yeah, this is where the little oinks came from, right? Living in this dark place is so depressing, you know. I don't care if I turn into a pig or not. Alright, see ya. Nice knowing you. Flavor text. Alright, hello, birds. Cough, cough, cough. Let me guess. Star shard. No. No, okay, fine. All right, let's giddy up. Let's save the game and let's see where the steeple creeple is. Hello, piggies. In this village, the moon is really all we can rely on. All right, all right. Bacon, got it. Oh my, hello. Hi, family. Mama. I haven't been able to buy food for my children since my husband turned into a pig. Now they're all so hungry. What should you do? Mommy, I'm hungry. Oh, dude. Kind traveler, if you have some spare food, could you share it? Uh, yeah, you know what? I, I have hot dogs. I'm kind of partial to them. You can have a mushroom. Oh, thanks so much. You made my children very happy and me as well. It's not much, but please take this as a thanks. Eh. Where do you hail? Uh-huh. Oh, no! The mom! Oh, my gosh! The mom! Hey, fix my mommy! Mommy, you're a piggy! Oh, gosh. Uh, hey, are pigs good eating? Yeah, you start gnawing on your mom, okay? You'll be fine. No! That's actually sad, because what are the kids gonna do, right? That's very sad. How are the kids gonna support themselves? Oh, someone's crying in here. I'm coming. Don't worry. I'm the healer of all feelings. Where do your items go? Oh, no! Ah, oh, customer. I'm sorry, we're not open right now. Well, you better get open. Huh, why am I crying? My husband's been turned into a pig. A pig! My husband went to the woods yesterday to collect herbs. But no husband came home. Instead, a pig returned. This pig! We got in a fight before he left, and I had him... I had called him a chauvinist pig. What? <laughs> oh my gosh. And now he really is a pig. But he has a sweet side, too, like cooking my favorite birthday. Oh my gosh, you just keep on talking. Like, stop talking. Uh, this isn't me pressing it. 
Okay, yeah, Mario just fell asleep. No, I don't care about your pig husband. So hey, could you figure out a way to restore my husband to normal? Okay, you can even take anything from the storeroom. All right, well, I'm, uh, let me go. My husband must have taken the key with him and lost it in the woods. Dang it! Okay, droning on and on about your husband. Don't care. Whose house is this? Why is it empty? You, open the door. Nasty monster lives in the woods past here, I'm serious. Uh-huh, uh, you need the mayor's permit? Who the heck is the mayor? Uh-huh, let's go ask Mario. I have not met a mayor yet. Hello, kid, are you the mayor? Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Yep, cool, cool, cool. Don't care. I'm curious about these birds, though. Why did they program the birds to have, like, a dialogue? If I'm gonna turn into a pig, I wanna be a big old fat one. Cause that, what's the point of being a skinny pig, right? Gotta embrace the pigginess. Yo, this guy, go big or go home, huh? Alright, I gotta go find this mayor. Mayor McCheese. Mayor McPiggy. Oh, the bell rang, Mara. That means someone's gonna... Whew, at least it's not me this time. Who was it? The mayor! Maybe the mayor's in the inn. I'll, I'll find the mayor. Are you the mayor? Oh. Ten coins? That's highway robbery, man. Piggy. Dude, I talked to all these fools. I could have sworn I talked to every single one. Oh, you're the mayor? The old... Oh, no! The old Gramps was the mayor. Oh, no. You don't think this is the mayor, do you? What do we do now, huh? We can't get his permission to pass through the gate. Oinky, oinky. Yeah, yeah. Smash, smash, smash. You'll make some bacon right now. That's funny. So maybe if I had Goombella behind me, Goombella would have addressed him as mayor versus Gramps. Okay. Oh, the gatekeeper's a pig now. Aha. Uh -huh. No, not gone. He turned into a pig. Well, not to be insensitive, but that works out for us. We can just cruise right on through. Later, you dumb pig. Later, Mido. Okay, look at this, look at this. All right, there's obviously something in there. Let me take that real quick, a black key. Okay, I don't know if that's the key to the shop or what, but we'll hold on to it for now. Okay, I probably should not have broken that. Oh, that's a green Goombabwe. Yeah! Watch this. Oh my gosh, 11 damage. Mamma mia. Eleven damage! Woo! Boy, let's go. It's a hyper Goomba, which means uh it's hyperactive, duh. Max HP 8, defense is zero, but if this nut goes bizarro and charges up, his attack power will be eight next turn. So you better wipe it out between the time it charges up and and the time it attacks. And if you can't beat him, run away, okay? Yeah, I'm... Oh my gosh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm just gonna play on the safe side. I don't know if my last stands are stacking right now, but... We're gonna play it safe. Ooh! I just need the Mario heads, please. There we go, beautiful. Alright, come at me, little guys. Watch, watch, watch. Get ready. Oh, he's going... Oh, no! Plus six. Okay, plus six. He has eight HP. That's really not good. So you gonna do some work, girlfriend, or what? No, we're just gonna double him.
That's called a super guard. That's called a super guard. I was able to super guard him. Oh, yes. Bring on the FP, babies. Let's go. Yo, should we put on some HP? Right? Like, we should totally do it. Should we put on some HP? I think we need it. A lot of you guys at home watching are like, Yo, Abdali, you gotta get that HP, man. The only way to play this game is to actually do it as I what I think, and you need HP. Nope. Absolutely not. FP drain now. Ooh, I can try that a little bit. Or we go FP plus. Yeah, we'll be okay. More badge points. Yeah! Okay, I gotta do something with these little guys. Uh, let's do a little switchy switchy. We'll do a little bit of bonky bonky. That's Hyper Paragoomba. It's a Hyper Goomba with wings. All right, after charging up. Okay, yep, yep, yep. Okay, deal. All right, so now I can do a little bit of multi-bounce just for the heck of it. Was that even worth it? No, it was, it was, because now Goombella can do the six damage and then KO each of them and I don't have to worry about taking any of these hits. So yeah, we're set. That was the perfect attack to do. Provided I can do the timing of this. Not too bad, not too bad. Easy multi-bounce. Okay, so get some six. That's really good. That's some good experience. I could totally go for even more. Just saying. There's one singular coin in that. Oh, you! All the Goombas are here! So Goombella is not going to do any work against these guys. That's unfortunate. So I can go Quake Hammer, and then spend the next turn bringing Cooper out. Uh-huh. Uh, after its attack rises to an incredible level of 9. That's scary. That will KO me. I've only this book listed a way to dodge that attack. Well, let's find out. Oh my gosh! Stop that! I'm dead. I'm dead. There's no way I can do this right now unless I do a, a plus six. Unless I do a plus five. No, it's not even worth risking. I'm out of here, dude. No. I can do the, like, the Earth Tremor. I can do it. Oh, 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 oh! I could do the Earth Tremor? No, 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 no. <laughs> I can do the Earth Tremor, yes. Um, but the odds of me missing the Earth Tremor? A near-perfect Earth Tremor. Let's, let's try them again. Five. I don't have enough FP. Oh gosh. I don't think I could do this one either. Let's try it. Oh my gosh! I missed it by a smidge. Fiverr? You know what? I can do Fiverr. Check this out. And he's just gonna power up and then we win. Okay, this is fine. Yeah, here we go. Scary though. I never had to to honestly run from a Goombabwe before. That's pretty crazy. And I'll take this. No, I won't. And it doesn't help that I had to waste a turn with Goombella. Just tattling on them. Those guys are a threat. Oh my gosh, they're a threat. Dang, wasted. I could have gotten an extra five coins off of that. A piggy! Hoink. 
Yo, get that for me. <laughs> Let me yoink that shop key right out of there. So I guess the question is, where does the black key go? So I got the shop key, and I got a mysterious black key. I don't remember seeing a black key door anywhere outside of the, uh, the shop, so... Open up. Huh. Oh, a life shroom. Yes. A new hammer. Defend plus. Hmm. How much is that? Better not be six badge points. It's five. I mean, I can do it soon. Maybe on the next level up, I'll do defend plus. Mara's defense goes up by one? Heck yeah. Give me that life shroom for starters. And I promise I won't eat it. Hold up, hey, who's there? I just heard a voice. Oh, not this guy. There's no way that people could be here, seriously. That's just so unlikely. That's gem and jelly, though. Oh, what do you say? You've seen a chest like this before. Get out of here. No, 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 I'm not like those chests, I promise. Look at my eyes. Tell me I'm lying. I'm not, I'm not, seriously. Just get me out of here, you'll see. Don't make me beg. This is what I do with the black key. Oh, come on, you know how ridiculous you sound right now. I'm laughing in here. You honestly think I'm going to curse you when I get out? Curse you? Well, I did plan on doing something to you, but it's not so much a curse as a, well, a really wonderful new ability that'll allow you to go special places. Doesn't that sound nice? Hey, this person's truthful. Oh, come on, please. Just find the key and open the chest, okay? I know it's here somewhere. I can't look for it myself because I'm in here. So pretty please? All right, I got you. Oh, thank goodness. You're uh, going to let me out. Oh, happy day. Yeah, here we go. Wee-hee! Fools! <laughs> oh, gosh. Here's the two eyeballs in the weird, trippy background. Making me into a boat, right? What were you expecting? Did you think a lovely lady would pop out or something? Now I'm gonna hit you with the king of curses. The cursiest curse ever. Fear my terrible power. You will know the pain of having your body roll up. Be cursed! Oh, body roll up. Oh, so I can go underneath the log? Ah, now you're cursed, loser. Savor your suffering. When this curse strikes you, you won't be able to walk, and that's how awful it is. Your suffering amuses me, and so I laugh. Now, show me your cursed plight so I can laugh all the more. Just press and hold R, then rotate repeatedly. Wee hee hee! Your pathetic misery thrills me to the core. You must roll around like a silly cardboard tube. Oh, how you'll be laughed at. Now, do you understand the depth of your agony? Yeah. No, I do get it. I'm sorry. I get it. I get it. I get it. Come on. Come on, Kepora Gebora. Dude, really? I get it. Stop. Yes, I understand. Press B to return to normal. Don't forget, mush brain. I'll leave you to suffer, fools. All right, that's cool. Good job. And I got a boo sheet, man. That's some boo sheet right there. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Yo, I got some jam and jelly here. You can hold on to this. Oh, you don't store things. All right. Yo, you guys ready for this? Here we go. Check this out. We wait. What? Yo, spam, spam email. Stop me from rolling. Get out of here. Way. Oh, dude, forget riding on my little Yoshi's back. I could just do this. Look at how fast I go. Right into a Goomba. Great. Oh my, look at you guys. Well, we're gonna have to do some work here, but I don't have anything to... Hey guys, what's up Transportation UK? How are you? Welcome. I just need the flowers. Dude! Double dude! Four. Not enough. Don't charge up. Oh, loaded, loaded. Here, he's, here he comes. Here he comes. And that's annoying. And what is this? A cape? That's 
a little overkill, isn't it? How much do you do on your shell hit? It's not gonna do it. I should have like charged. Why didn't you hit the other guy behind him? Oh, it's over. No thanks. This is going to be a world of hurt, mind you. Power shell hits both of them for four, then I could do... I don't know. I don't even know. I can't even math this right now. It's four damage? That's good. But what about my Quake Hammer? Does that do enough? Five? Yo, big boy missed! Oh, gosh! Help me! Oh, good. Woohoo! Super guarding all day! That was the nine damage hit, mind you, that we just super guarded. Look at this guy. These guys are scary, especially because I don't have any FP. Whoa, what in the- oh, I was gonna say, a repel cape. Nah, that's alright. Okay, this is not annoying. I don't want to fight you. I do want to fight you, but I don't have the power to fight you. Uh-huh, uh-huh, here we go. So this is like the uh, the three little piggies, right? The three little piggies blowing this shack down. Interesting. FP regen. I kind of want to use it right now. Into the woods we go, ladies and gents. Here we go, we made it to the woods. Oh, gosh, Crazy Daisies! Oh my goodness, Crazy Daisies. Really? Can any of you guys confirm that a Crazy Daisy is in the game? Woo! Boy, seven. Gone. See ya! That's cool. If you can get the first strike with that jump, it's really great. That's a Crazy Daisy. It may look totally cute, but it's a serious foe. Max HP 7. Uh-huh, uh-huh. What you gotta worry about is it's lullaby. Oof. Guard well, though. You might pass out. Okay. When its HP runs low, it tries to run away. Okay, so my jump attacks don't do anything. Amazy Daisy. That's what I meant. Yeah, yeah. Amazy Daisy. The golden ones. Now, the question is, do the golden Amazy Daisies appear in the overworld? Or do they just appear in the battle randomly whenever you come across one of these little daisies? So that's the information that I would like to clarify. In the previous Paper Mario, they weren't random appearances within a battle. Oh my gosh, wow. That, I don't know the timing of that. That's a misclick! Are you flipping kidding me? I just pressed the A button because I think I was going to jump. Now this guy's going to run away because it's at 1 HP and there goes my little experience for that. How lame is that? Ugh. Guess we're all kind of full, aren't we? Bye, Felicia. They're too experienced to pop and they're very bulky. So I don't even know if they're worth it. Alright, I can squeeze through there if I wanted. All right, I'm gonna have to. An earthquake! I don't know, I kinda wanna get rid of this boo sheet. Oh, whatever. See you later, earthquake. 
I would have loved to have KO. Oh my gosh. We are dead. If I don't do something, I could have used that. Oh, shooting star is going to be great. Drop shooting star. Yeah, I'm going to have to. I'm going to do quake and then... Oh, beautiful, beautiful. If this makes it... And they're holding two items, too. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's unfortunate. Oh, no! Uh, I'm gonna use the item. I have to, or else we're all gonna die. Good. One of them survived? May I ask how? The mist? I'm taking that earthquake. <laughs> I need that now. If there's going to be like crazy daisies. Ah! Um, 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 hold on, hold on. Cooper is my best bet for crazy daisies. I haven't messed around with Baby Boy yet. I haven't used Enderman. So I don't know what ability he has, but. Okay, this is interesting, because I don't have data on this cleft. I think I have to hammer it. Only makes sense. I can super hammer it if I wanted to. Let's see how much a regular hammer does. None! Great, because I missed the timing. And he's at plus six! Oh, Mario's asleep. Great. You better do some work, big boy. I think we need to go. I think we need to go. <laughs> oh, I think we need to go. I need to go. Okay, 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 okay. Now we need to play. Okay, now you ready for this? Come here. I need to redo that battle real quick. That's what I wanted first turn. Whew. All right, tell me about this dumb thing. Quake hammer, most likely? That's a hyper clef, basically a clef that uses charge up moves, max HP 4, defense is 3, when it charges up its attack power rises to 9, a couple of its rock hardness with its ability to charge up and things get scary. You're confident you may want to try doing super guards to send its attack back. You can, you better use some items or you better hightail it out of there. I don't know what to do, spin jump, I'll do a regular jump. But if I fall asleep it's over. No, I can try quake. And I knocked him upside down, so that's a beautiful thing. So Quake Hammer, when in doubt. I pressed it. It's fine, it's fine. You're gonna get it. Dude, no! A little late? Oh my gosh. Dude, what is actually happening? What it, I'm I'm gonna lose. Dude, you had like 20 turns in a row. Are you kidding me? Wow, I was about to lose right there. Hold on, hold on. What is actually happening here? This can't be a dead end. Something here.
Wait, what? Hold on. What? Oh my gosh. B blocking that is like nigh impossible. Are you kidding me? I just got in here. Alright, uh, we'll probably try out some other abilities. Uh, I'll try kicking it with a Koopa, I'll try bringing a Flurry, blowing it. That's what she does best. Here we go. Oh. Okay. Lame. Uh-huh, I see that. Something there. We're gonna do this again? Alright. You're very useful, huh, Flurry? You're not very useful, huh, Flurry? What the heck? Oh, ah, uh, maybe I can do this. And roll under it. Like a little burrito. No. Uh-huh. What are we blowing over here? Oh my gosh! What? Wow, cool, huh? Let me go this way, though. Okay. Oh, look at that. If I push the rock in the back, it moves in the front. Interesting. I don't want to play with Flurry anymore. Okay, cool. Oh, gosh, no! Help me! Okay. This guy, uh, I need some work. I'm gonna do some work. How much HFP do I have? I got seven FP, I'm good, I'm good. Check this out. You want some? Come here. As long as you don't hit me. Nya, nya! Okay, <laughs> oh my gosh. If he got the first strike, I would've died. Oh my gosh, look who's here! Okay. Yeah, I think we're gonna do this. I think we're gonna do this. Here we go, here we go. I can't! I don't know how to do hers! I don't know how to do hers at all! Dead! Dead! No! Oh my gosh, no! 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 Because I don't know how to multi-bounce? You're crazy! You're actually crazy. I'm so upset. That's so bad because I don't know how to multi-bounce and I couldn't figure it out. Oh, mamma mia. Probably by one HP though. Bet. Bet by one HP. Someone do the math. And look, I'm given I'm given the power up plus right here. Don't worry, it'll come back. Just like in the other game, it'll come back. Oh my gosh, I would have loved that. I would have honestly loved that. Okay, so I so now we know they're not in an overworld spawn, but they're going to be an in battle spawn. So upset. So upset at myself for that. I don't know the timing for the multi bonk. Ugh. It's annoying. Creepy steeple where the monster supposedly lives. This place creeps me out. Let's get that crystal star and get out of here as fast as we possibly can, okay? That's 10 coins for a heal? No thanks. Too rich for my blood, man. Weak, it won't open. Okay, it looks like we're gonna have to roll underneath or go inside the pipe. Oh, buzzy beetles, cool, nice try. I love Buzzy Beetles because we eat them for breakfast like this. Let's go badge points, man. I need more badge points to get my defense up a little bit. Oh, look who's here. Yeah. Shine Sprite. Okay, okay. Oh my gosh. Hello? Oh, 
Oh, you guys don't even attack right here. That's funny. Well, that's a thing. I don't want to hammer one. I guess I could hammer him, right? I'll beat them all up. Hammer does nothing against them, but... Oh, no, it does work. Oh, that's pretty good, but... Um, let's do this. That's fine. Yeah, yeah, we'll beat these guys up. They're two a pop. Five. Oh my gosh. Five is good. Let's go. Alright, I don't have any FP, so we're just going to keep on doing this. Oh, you're a spiky boy. Interesting. <laughs> spiky boys. I didn't realize that this one was a spiky, a spike top, buzzy beetle with a spike on its back. Max HP 5, okay. HP's 5, that's fine. Okay, fire and explosions don't do anything to it, flip it over, defense drops to 0, etc, etc. That's fine. Guess what? Bum bring, bum bring. That's 3 experience worth. You know, I think we're gonna level up soon. Beautiful. Just the right amount of health, too. Oh my gosh, help me. Oh, we're both in danger. This is not good. If I don't do this hammer hit right, I got a quick hammer. I have to. We oh my gosh, nice and lucky. Oh my goodness. <laughs> we need to do something, man. Seven experience, that's fine. Keep on bringing it. Let's go. Who wants more? Who wants more? We got all day for this. Oh, it's a singular? It's a little baby's ice cream. Alright, so now we do a little bit of this. With a little bit of this, 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 this. Whew! It's exhilarating. Alright, kind of cute. HP's 5, pretty good defense. Alright, if you jump on it, you drop its defense down. Then it's at our mercy. Ha, don't hesitate. Jump, jump, jump. Got it. Okay, we're gonna not hesitate. I was gonna use a star power thing, but I think I'm okay. We're fine. Goombella's not gonna die. She's very hardy. She's got 20 HP. She's been really hitting it. Oh my gosh, no! That's bad. That's absolutely bad right now. Okay, well, we need to do something about this. And that is going to be using an item. I didn't want to do this, but here it is. Yeah, I was not expecting these dweebs. And there's more. There's a lot. There's a lot more here. Yikes! I need multi-balance so bad in my life. Or else we're gonna eat a world of hurt. Okay, this is where that item actually would have came in handy. All I have is hot dogs. So I can do this. Uh, I can multi-bounce? Yeah, 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 let's do that. Okay, so check this out. Watch, watch, watch. We're gonna go items. I'm gonna use my one and only syrup. I had it just in case, and then now is one of those occasions where a just in case would be very helpful. So we're gonna do a little bit of multi-bounce. One, two, three, four, yahoo! And now, that saved us. That did nothing for us. Okay, great. It saved us a turn of attacking. That's fine. That's terrible. And I needed that. Who's throwing some? Oh, a pow block. Oh, sweet. Yo, who threw that? Yo, thanks, man. Thanks, man. Yo, hit him. Oh, great. This is not good. Missed. Th oh, my gosh. I can't afford that. We might lose. We actually might lose. Do 
this can't miss. This is unmissable. Clock out. Yo, let me clock out these guys. When A, B, X appears over the enemy, tap that button. I don't know. B. X? B? Oh my gosh, I'm pressing something. Oh my gosh, what in the world just happened? I've never done that before. We lose! We lost! Oh my gosh, we lost. I've never done that before. No, you're not supposed to eat that. That's reserved for me. Oh my gosh. This is terrible. This is absolutely terrible. Directions unclear. Oh my gosh. Directions unclear, sorry. <laughs> when it when it goes above the enemy. Oh, get me out of here. Oh my god. Tornado jump, execute superbly to damage all mid-air enemies. Oh my lord, what the heck just happened to us? Goombella, you ate my shroom without asking. That's my only life shroom. Madam Hyde? <sighs> Welcome. What the heck is the point? Oh. Are we supposed to, like, roll or something? I, I don't have a boo that's going to help hide me over here. Madam Hyde, welcome. So maybe when we get Vivian, I think, that's how this is going to pan out? I think maybe I need to spend 10 coins. Alright, fine. Fine. You can have the 10 coins. Alright, now we feel good. Mamma mia, that was a rough battle. It's a really rough battle. I knew something was gonna be hiding there. Like, look. I knew something was gonna be hiding out of reach. Or like, out of sight, out of mind. I'm like, oh, something by the tree. Something over here by the fence. I knew it. I knew it. Rewarding exploration. All right. You got anything else? We good here? All right, let's go in. Whew. Okay, something up top. Something up top. Oh, doors. All right, let's go in a door. Oh, hey, my friends have all been taken away. So lonely. Well, I know you're, uh, I know Bo. Remember Bo from the previous game? My friends are all gone, so very lonely. All right, got it, got it. Dang, that's the star piece. That's the thing inside Mario 64. Remember in the back of the, the castle? By the ghost area? That's exactly what this is. A little Easter egg to Mario 64. Kind of cool. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Oh, 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 burrito time. I'm a burrito, number one. Oh yeah, baby, let's go. And I see that star crystal over there. You can't hide that from me. A cookbook. And an ice smash. Okay, here we go. I need to get up top. I need to get that key. That key's to that door. So I'm probably gonna bring Flurry. Flurify, and let's see what we can figure out. Fake. Oh, so confident in that. Oh, this is actually lame. Uh-huh, uh-huh. 
Alright, Goombella, talk to me, girlfriend. What do we got here? Creepy steeple, uh, at least the moon provides a little light. Okay, this place seems super old. I like to research it. Okay, the moon and the light. Uh, maybe that's the hint that I'm trying to get over here? What is that? Oh, what in the world? No, you can't push this. How are you supposed to know that? That's weird. Like, unless you just randomly walked up against it like I did, how are you supposed to know that you're supposed to move that? I don't know about that, man. Creepy. Flower saver. Drop FP used when Mario attacks by one. That's pretty good. How many badge points is that flower saver? Four? <laughs> no. Absolutely not. No, son. Absolute four. Yeah, four badge points. What do you think I am? Made out of badge points? It's a good one. Oh, I like it, but I don't have the badge points for it. All right, here we go. Jack in the box. Oh, great. It's like Luigi's Mansion. That's how Luigi's Mansion started, right? They were all hidden, and then he opens it up, and then they all go scattering. It's quiz time, interloper. Just now, when the box opened, how many boosts came out? A hundred. What? How are you supposed to know? Come on, a hundred's like the perfect number. Oh man. It's locked from the inside. Okay, okay. Now the boos are here. Now I can go in those doors up top. Hello. What's wrong with you? Are you gonna be mean to me? No. I have no reason to. Promise? Come on out, guys. Okay. I said I wasn't gonna be mean. What's your problem? Whoa, swooper be swooping. Come here. All right, let's get these guys. Three six. Oh, six HP is wonderful. But I can't touch these guys if they're up top without quake hammering, and I don't want to have to do that. So let's just paddle, and then I'll appeal. That's a swooper. I bet they'll call it because uh, of the way it swoops around. Wow, that's some awesome naming work. Seriously, it's pure naming genius. So anyway, max HP 6, H attack is 3. It says here it hangs from the ceiling. If you can just damage it, it'll drop to the ceiling. Then you can whack it. Well, how about I just chill? I don't have to. Come on over here. Yeah! Woo, boy! That's called a perfect, a perfect guard. I really have to practice her multi-bonk. Or else I can't take her to endgame like I did with Goombarayo in the previous game. Goombarayo is the best. My son! Alright, here we go. Whoa, whoa, swooper be swooping. Oh, you ready? Swoop this way, dude. Boom! Big one. Yo, what's up, Ming? Hey, Ming, what's up? What's going on, Ming? Welcome. Yo, Ming. Ouch. Okay, that was rude. Both of you guys. Okay, so this is, uh, I was forced to do this now. I was not wanting to do that. Oh my gosh, I don't know who they're aiming for. That's really rough. Alright, here we go.
I like that the poison ones were right next to each other. So I didn't have to worry about that. So we got 665, pretty good. Everyone's full. And then now we can finish this fool off. With the final head bonkers in. Woo! Easy. Hey, I could use, oh my gosh, I could use that experience double right now. Thank you. One, two, three, four, five, that's nine? Uh, I can't even count that, it looks like 10. I'll take that. And we're going FP, baby. Not? I need HP. I need HP so bad, guys. I'm like dying every other turn here. I actually need some FP this time around. Or HP, I'm sorry. I need HP. What should we do, guys? Should we do it? Should we just do it? To satisfy the masses? Should we so do it? I, I, I need it. Oh, that's a misclick! What it, What happened? No, I meant to do HP. No, what's gonna happen? Now I'm not gonna beat the game because I don't play how you want me to play. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, yes. Dang, dude. Dang, dude. He straight did it again. I need Defend Plus. Hold on, what do I have? Equipped Badges. FP Plus is good. Like, it helps me out. Yes, yes. There's some things that I don't need. Like... Oof. I'm not really using Charge all that much. I'll use Charge when the bosses come. Like, I don't need it right now, so that saves me one. And Close Call, I mean, that kind of helps out. But I need one badge point. Last Stand I love, Power Rush I love, Simplifier, mm, no I need that in my life, Last Stand I love, Mega Rush is great. Alright, we're gonna go Close Call, I need to get rid of that. Alright, here we go, so now that we have that, we're gonna go Defense up. Where the heck is it? Defend Plus. Bling! Alright, so now, Mario's defense is even stronger. Things are not going to touch him. All right, you ready for this? Yeah, I'm not honestly using charge all that much. I should be, but remember, it costs one FP to do, and it doesn't seem worth it. And see, that, ladies and gents, is why you never invest in HP. Just kidding. You can do whatever the heck you want. I'm not going to tell you how to play the game. All right, this is going to lead me to the key with Koops. What do these ghosts do? Besides aesthetics? Are they just here to troll me? Like, what are they doing? Will they eventually, like, attack me? I don't even know. Mmm. Whoa, whoa, that swooper, though. Get back here. Go ahead. Come on. Out with it, then. Oof. Oh, I did? That counted. Wow, beautiful. If I was that swooper, I would be so upset. Yeah, if I was that swooper, I would be very mad. Because he's like, dude, I swooped him. He didn't touch me. <laughs> and yet my partner died at the beginning of battle. I would have been so upset if I was that swooper. Give me that. Is there another one? Yes, there is. Here we go. Swoop down. Swooping! Oof! Again, another instance of me destroying one of his partners. And Abu! Oh, Abu Nahasapima Penelon, man. Let's get him. All right, we're going to do this first. Oh my gosh. Quick Hammer doesn't hit a ghost? What is going on? And he's using a dizzy dial. Ugh. Ugh. That's a boo. Uh, it's everyone's favorite ghost. Well, most everyone. Seven HP, okay. It's nothing to write home on this uh, attack side, but it can turn invisible. If it turns invisible, we won't be able to hit it, so beat it up while you can see it. Boos are kind of cute, but I'm sure I wouldn't want to meet one in a dark alley. If I ran into one in the bathroom in the middle of the night, I'd... Well, never you mind what I'd do. <laughs> Seven? All right, let's go. Dang. By one. 
That's annoying. Yahoo! Oh my gosh! Head bonkerson, get it! Yeah! Okay, okay. And I don't want to potentially hit the miss on this. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna defend. Dude! I pressed it! I pressed it, I swear I did. Yo! Oh my, how do you find out who he's aiming? <laughs> okay, last try. I need to actually learn this. Like, the character lights up beforehand, right? Goombella. Got him. Save 3 FP by doing that. Okay. Your character lights up slightly before the attack hits. Hey, Luigi's in, in the stands. That's pretty cool. I thought he was over there in, like, Sarasa land or wherever. Remember he said he was, like, off in, like, pudding country or whatever it is? Okay, what's the point of this? Oh, 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 the golden leaf! Yo, that has to be something uh, that's a recipe, right? You put a golden leaf in like a jam and jelly or something? Whoa. Cool, right? Alright, so the one thing that I haven't determined is what happens when you hit this thing? We hit one on the opposite side, and then we hit one now over here. So I haven't really seen a difference as to what it does, but... We'll find out. We'll find out soon enough. Whoa, the golden leaf. Yeah, don't touch me, kids. Um, I don't. Did we go this way? No, we hit both of them. Okay, you guys are annoying. Oh, this is just where I found them, right? Okay. And it's locked from the inside. Alright, great, great. Let's see what kind of puzzle we have to figure out here. Rumbled in tens. Alright, so hitting it once. I don't know what it's doing, to be honest. Let's find out. Okay, is it switching? I'm sorry, is it switching the staircases here? Okay, that could be it. There's three doors in the staircases. I need to bring it to the third one. And, uh, so if I hit this two more times, the staircase is gonna be pushed all the way over, and then I could go across to the key door, which I think I may have the key, I don't remember. Let's see, that's my, that's my prediction. Yeah, yeah, there we go, I know Mario games, there we go, that's a little bit of logic. Took me a little bit. I do have the steeple key. I don't remember where I got it, but... Oh yeah, it was on the other side, and I used Cooper to kick it and grab it. Alright, do we need healing? It's recommending we do. So, 10 coins? I mean, that's no sweat off my back. We're pretty rich with 256. Let's just do it. It's probably before a boss, right? We're at this for two hours? Let's go. What's up, Atlas Sophie? Hey, welcome. Atlas, Sophie, hey, what's happening? How are you? Thanks so much for coming to the stream today. I hope you're enjoying Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. Everyone welcome, Atlas. Alright, so who's here? Hey, uh, hang on there, Slick. Oh, is this Dupless guy? 
Interrupting my me time. This is the monster the mayor was talking about? You gotta be kidding me. Who are you calling a monster? What's your problem? Why do you need to pick a fight? I'm busy thinking up new pranks and stuff. It's not easy either. Now get lost. Of course, you guys won't. No way you ninnies go away quietly, am I right? Well, all right then, Slick. Fine, yes, I turned the villagers into pigs. Big deal. Big deal? You big jerk. Why would you do something like that? Well... You know, they're all so depressing and boring and dim-weighted all the time. So instead of wallowing in gloom, I figured they might as well wallow in mud. Ha! Huh. Now that they're pigs, get it? Isn't that just so perfect? It's like irony or something. So what? You got a problem with that? I guess you do. So let's play Slick. Well, I didn't put charge on. That's unfortunate. I guess I should have, but whatever. You think I need charge? I don't. Talk to me about him. Wow, how totally bizarre. This thing isn't listed here. There's a monster in here that looks like this thing, but it doesn't list the name. Max HP is 40, attack is 4, and defense is 0. It is apparently really good at transforming itself and other things. Maybe it used that power to turn the villagers into pigs. This thing's a real jerk. Okay, I mean, that's fine. I'll do, like, at least 10 damage on this guy per power bounce, so we're good. It's 11 damage, enjoy it. Yuck, 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 I guess I'll get down and dirty if you're gonna play like that, Slick. Come at me! Oh my gosh, that's so scary. Alright, you wanna try? You wanna try this multi bunk girlfriend? Let's go, I need it, I need it. Yeah, girl! You want some? Hmm, time to regroup here. So you think you're a couple of heavies, huh? Well then, my dear friends, you ought, uh, if you thought changing folks into pigs was impressive, then you're gonna love this. I've got something very special for you here. Oh gosh. Oh, how do you like them apples? Now that's magic, people. Now you're fighting yourself. Ha! Huh. I'm a dang genius. Not today! 10 damage? Where did you get... Uh, Actually, I want to see what this thing is. Oh, it's the same thing? Oh, that's lame. I could have ended it right there. I thought we'd get a little Shadow Mario... Um, bestiary entry, but you know, you ask me if it actually matters because it doesn't. Now what? Yuck, yuck, yuck. Hold on. What? What? Huh? You beat me. That's it. Come on. It's too easy. That's like Rock Hawk. No, come on, game. I'm waiting for like the false ending. But that's not happening. All right, well, whatever. Mari defeated the scourge of Creepy Steeple and found the fourth crystal star. The people at Twilight Town have surely recovered from their awful curse by now. At this rate, Mario's quest to collect all seven crystal stars will be done in no time. With his back to Creepy Steeple, Mario sets out towards his bright future. I mean, yes, multi or power balance is pretty OP if you get the timing for at least 11 damage, but like, <laughs> doing that with Goombella and the power attack, like, I didn't even have to use any strats. I took one hit of damage, maybe two with that Mario bounce, but the game's easy. 
What can I say? The game's easy. And some of you guys are worrying about me having 10 HP. Are you kidding me? Let's just eliminate all that worries. We're gonna be fine. I hope the game gets harder, though. Alright, so, thanks so much for watching! Oh, man. I wanted it to be way harder. Dude, that guy had the same HP as Rockhawk, and, like, that's it. I don't know. I, I stopped my recordings. The chapter is done. We'll do, we'll do some more later. I, I'm... The chapter's done. <laughs> uh, don't don't go fooling me into thinking this chapter is not done. Whenever a curtain closes, I close off the live stream. Anyway, it's been about two hours, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. It'll be fun. So thanks so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to smash that like button, share the video with a friend. Uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow, bright and early, for even more of Paper Mario: The Thousand Year Door. I don't want to hit the A button one more time. We'll find out on the next one, don't worry. <laughs> Whenever the curtain closes and it saves, that's how I'm gauging this. If there's more, then we'll find out tomorrow. Don't you worry about it. Okay, so, if you guys didn't already subscribe, make sure you guys do so. I need to take a quick breather anyway. This is, uh, this is really rough. Anyway, go! Hit that subscribe button, all of you guys, right now. What are you waiting for? Uh, we have the Origami King happening on 716, which is uh, a good couple months from now. So make sure you're on top of that. Uh, right over here, you guys can re-watch the Paper Mario walkthrough. We did another hyper-offensive run in that one. Super cool. And then uh, we're in the middle of uh, this one. Paper Mario... Oh, where did it go? Oh, here. Never mind. Oops. Yeah, Paper Mario, Thousand Year Door, Super Paper, and then Sticker Star Color Splash. It's going to be a fun time. I want you guys on board with it. So, All right. We'll see you guys later. There's more. It's a fake ending? What fake ending? Hold on. Jack says that there's more. A lot of you guys are saying that there's more. How much more? <laughs> Alright, I need to look this up. Should we do it? How is this a fake ending? They don't do that in this game. Now, the question is... Is there more? <laughs> Is there more? Is there like another final boss of this chapter? Because if that's the case, then I have to go. I have to continue playing it. I don't want to press the A button. I don't want to press the A button. All right, I was, look, I guess I made my own fake ending about to cut to end screen. Here we go, let's see. I'll do it. I'll do it. I can do another, like, 15, 20 minutes. Let's go. I did save, so we could turn it off, if anything. Wow, are you kidding me? That, what a total pushover. <laughs> That's what I was saying. We got the Crystal Star, so let's get out of here. I'm watching that Mario shadow. Did it move? Oh my gosh! Hello? It's a me, Mario. Okay, this is kinda cool. I need to take a bath though. Oh yeah, take a little bath, take a shower. What is this? Oh my. Mamma mia! Okay. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh, 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 oh. My party's not here. It's just me and Mario. 10 HP. 3 FP. I'll do some battles. I'll pay for this though. I need that FP if I'm going solo. Oh my gosh! If I'm going solo, where's my meat shield? Where's my meat shield of a daughter? I have a feeling I have to go into the middle of the room. I don't want to find out what the booze do, though. Or maybe I just gotta get the heck out of here. Alright, let's get out of here.
Yeah, this time we'll take that Mario and get his map. With this super bomb bomb here, or bomb bomb, bomb bomb, uh, there's no way we can fail. No, not likely. Good. Vivian, hand me that glorious super bomb bomb. Huh? Vivian, don't you dare. Does that hum mean what I think it does? I never had it. You were holding it just two seconds ago. You said it was too important to trust me with. Oh, you terrible liar. Stop making up stories to cover for yourself. If you don't have it, then you obviously have it, and obviously you lost it. Or are you trying to imply that I lost it, you little lollygagging worm? I uh, no, of course not. Beldum. Well, we can't do much without it, now can we? Oh, you are such an idiot. Very well. I'm sure you must have dropped it around here somewhere. So why don't you look for it while Marilyn and I go take a well-earned siesta. And if you don't find it, well, you know what'll happen, don't you? I, I get punished? That's right, you little twit, so get cracking. Come, Marilyn, let's leave this useless little fool to her chore. Go. Alright, so you're gonna go find a bomb, and I'm out here as, like, Shadow Mario. Oh my, that I can just break things with his mind. Very cool. Oh no, oh no, I need to run from these battles, especially this one. Oh! One damage? Um, where are my partners? Three is not enough. Oh, I missed the last one, that's lame. I hate the mist so much. This is scary. This is solo Mario. I can't play solo Mario. I should have invested in HP. <laughs> wow. Wee. Wee. Yahoo. Get that big money back. All right, here we go. Solo Mario, without a partner. Alright, who's coming? Crazy? Oh, I'm coming. I'll fight. I oh, if he puts me to sleep, I'm dead. Uh, let me see. If there's two of them, I'll fight. This was supposed to be a super bounce, but it didn't. Ooh. It was a super bounce. Yes, it was. Okay, deal, deal, deal. Okay, so I can, I can, um, hmm. I can quite camera you. Okay, doing pretty well. My FP is pretty much halved right now. I still have not seen a Crazy Daisy, or an Amazy Daisy. I've not seen one of those ever since I lost the first one. So here's hoping. This is too much for me. I can't handle these guys. I gotta run. Yeah, there's, that's too much. Take my five coins, whatever. You, I'll, I'll take a look at you. Okay, yeah, I'll fight these guys. That's a little unfortunate, because now I am stuck. I'm gonna regret this. They're gonna put me to sleep first turn. Oh, good. No, no! Stop! Oh my gosh! Stop! You punks! Oh my gosh, I need to not deal with that right now. Sleepy, sleepy. Alright, well, let's find out what happened to my friend. Oh, 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 yeah! Burrito time! Alright, here we go. Solo Mario's not a good, uh... 
Can't do work, sorry. Whoop. I'll do work against a singular Goomba. If I have to, but nah. I need my, uh, oh, hey, what's up, Slick? Been waiting for you. Yeah, you're Mario, right? What a great name. And I really dig this body, too, man. I can jump now. And hey, you're so popular around here. I get mobbed. I just love being you. Yeah, it's so cool. I don't think I ever want to stop. So you figured out by now, right? Slick, your body and name belong to me now. See, I've got the power to change my shape in any one I want. It comes in handy. But to really be someone, I need to take their name and body, too. Which means you turn into a shadow and can't use your name. Tough break, Slick. That's not enough, either. I aim to erase you for good. Guess it'll be... Uh, it'd be unsporting to ruin you without a challenge, so I'll give you one chance. If you guess my real name, then I'll give you back your name and body. What do you say, Slick? This'll be fun, right? Now guess, what's my name? Hit me with your best shot. <laughs> Is it actually Dupless? Because I could have sworn that's the only thing I remember. That's what I would have put anyway. Wait! Wait, the P's not there! <laughs> the lowercase P's not there, though! Wrong Amundo, little nobody! Who named their kid that? Prepare for doom, slick! Yuck, 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 and don't even think about running from battle here. No running. 1v1 me. You ready? Oh, I'll start off real strong. Let's go. Let's go full health, baby. I should have healed up before this battle. I can multi-bounce better than you! I got a poison one. I honestly just want the flowers. Oh my gosh! That's so scary being on the receiving end of that. What? What is actually happening now? What is going on? Wait, we don't deal any damage to each other? Who's throwing something? Who spoilers in the audience? Get them! Be throwing rocks. All right, so nothing's working. That's cheap. Why did I do that again? Thinking about something else. Stop throwing rocks at me, guys. Alright, alright. Something's going on here. I have to figure out the gimmick. I thought they said no running from this. Aw, that's no fun. Hello. Uh, huh? I don't understand this madness. Oh, I don't hate- I hate this guy. I need another life shroom, though. I collect the goods, sell them simple, yep, yep, yep. Okay. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. This is awkward. I guess my pig husband isn't a husband at all. This guy is as younger and cuter than my husband, actually. What a strapping fellow. Maybe it's time I traded in for a new husband. Oh, I'm only fooling. Greetings. <laughs> All right, here, I need to sell some junk I got. Um, yeah, I don't need a dizzy dial. Thank you, and I wanna store some things. I don't care. Like, you told me that already. Store, here we go. Yeah, store the jam and jelly. Uh, store the golden leaf, because I'm not gonna use that yet. And then I'm gonna store the, the boo sheet. And then I'm gonna, I guess I'm gonna use this life shroom. It's 40, it's pretty cheap, right? 
No, I don't need it yet. I'll go without it. All right, well, let's kind of, let's see what we have to do for this chapter. I thought we were done. So we can go talk to the mayor. We can do a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, hey, what's up, cheerleaders? The traveling sisters. Uh, we were pigs, and now you're not pigs. Cool. Oh, that's right. Poor you. I'm a ghost just like you. Maybe this is the way I can get you to join my team. I'm looking for something very important. If I don't find it, my sister's gonna punish me again, but it's not here. Oh, here, don't worry, I'll help you. I'm good at searching bushes like this. There it is, found it. It's a grenade. It's a super bomb bomb. Here you go. What, you found it? Oh, thank you so much, thank goodness. At least I won't get punished now. Oh no, it's broken. It must have broken when my sister dropped it. What'll I do, what'll I do? Uh, I guess it was meant to be punished for life. Hey, don't feel bad. Here, let me fix it. Let me fix this bomb for you. You don't even don't even bother trying. It's really busted. What do I do now, huh? My sister will be my sisters will be back any minute now. But I do appreciate your offer. Thank you. Hey, wait just a second. What's your name anyway? Why won't you tell me? What? I can't hear you. Your name was stolen. I see. Uh, well, I guess that happens from time to time. Wait, no it doesn't. Your name was stolen? That's absolutely crazy. I'm pink like you. Oh, gee whiz. You have uh, way worse problems than I do. And you were worried about me the whole time. That's so kind. Alright, that's it. I'm gonna help you get back your name and your body and your friends. Hey, that's okay. Don't worry about my problems. I'm not sure I really want to stay with my sisters anymore anyway. And I feel like I need to repay your earlier kindness. It's the right thing to do. So, uh, here we go. Yo, Mario's getting all these kisses. Vivian, look how tall you are. Vivian. All right, so we got Vivian in the house and I have enough star sprites in order to power her up. Press X to have uh, Vivian pull Mario into the shadows where they can hide. Oh, remember, oh, there we go. So this is just like Bo. Okay, so I have a feeling I have to go back to the ghost house and then maybe disappear from those ghosts for some reason. Set her enemies on fire with her shade fist. Or she and Mario can hide in the shadows to avoid damage with her veil move. Oh my gosh, yes. So she's exactly like Bo from the previous game. I love it. I guess uh, there's no need to find out uh, the ghost's real name first, huh? That'll be a start. So how are we going to get that kind of information? Hey, I have, a, I have an idea. Birds pretend to be innocent with people around. But they're actually uh, well informed uh, from all that flying and eavesdropping. With my power, you can listen in the conversations without them knowing. So in addition to the villagers, let's try to get some info from the local birds. Uh, at least that's what they could, I could do with my powers. All right, cool, cool. But uh, let's see if we get you powered up. For some reason, you can't enter the pipe. Oh, because my name's not on my butt. So I was chatting with Rotbeak in the Mushroom Town, an instant messenger yesterday. Instant messenger, okay. And he said he's just gone fiber optic on his home network. Can you believe that? Rad. I bet he's downloading a hundred meg apps with no problem on those fat pipes. A hundred meg. Wow. He's probably surfing that feather club for crow's sight at the speed of light now. Yeah, it just blows me away. All this, all this information age hype you hear about. And yet it's all games and feather loss sites that are driving the technology. Yeah, but I think tech bust survivors can thrive if they get viable business models. Okay. That's too true. I've been really depressed lately, thinking about uh, the depletion of fossil fuels. <laughs> yeah, tell me about it. We've got to come up with a renewable energy source before that happens. Yeah, like wind or hydroelectric. I think solar energy probably has the greatest potential. Dang, this is 14 years ago, folks. Nothing's changed, sorry. Yeah, we're all about that, uh, that oil life, right? Dang, that's crazy. 14 years. 14 years ago, and that's uh, that's what they're kind of predicting out here. Interesting. 
Alas, this Twilight world is too full of pain and contradiction, too full of broken dreams. Perhaps I was the only one given wings so that I could flee the terror of m uh, mundanity. Alright. Hey, Maud, listen to this. Ronnie, my oldest, has taken his SATs this year. <laughs> oh, is little Ronnie that age already? Well, bless my feathers, Flo. The SATs, huh? Wow, look at that. That's, that's pretty localized. Alright, the last ones. Here we go. So that Mario guy meeting with the mayor, he's actually the bad guy, right? And nobody even knows. Humans are so dumb. It makes me want to peck their noses. The only soul that knows the bad guy's name is locked under creepy steeple, I hear. Because, you know, if no one knows your name, then you can use unstoppable magic. But if someone says your real name to you, then your magic will stop working. So I wonder how all this is going to end up then. Did you hear that, Mario? If we search under the Creepy Steeple, maybe we can find out that guy's real name. Let's go to Creepy Steeple. Alright, well, let's go. Hey, what's up, Slick? Been waiting for you. I would have done this back in town, but that wouldn't have looked very good, would it? Oh, there he is. So, this is the one who stole your name and body. Hmm, he looks sort of familiar to me. Alright, can the chatter. Here's the deal. You get your chance, then I stomp you. If you guess my real name, then you get your body name and bag. Fire away, no name. The P is gone again. <laughs> uh, what are we going to call him? No name. Wrongamundo! Who'd name their kid that? Prepare for doom, slick. Yuck, yuck, yuck. And don't even think about running from battle here. Name him Bushi. <laughs> that would have been a good one. Okay, let's see what we got here. Hey, we got Parker. Hey, what's up, Parker? Shade Fist. Press the button that appears on the screen. What's up, Parker? How are you? Welcome. I can't touch this guy. Aww, that's no fun. He must have been hiding there in ambush, waiting for you to show up. Well, forget him. Let's go get your name back. Ah, uh, mommy! Fine. Seven damage is seven damage. I'm not going to say no to that. That's an easy one KO. And then Shadow Mario's got the big hits. Check this out. Watch this big punch. Oh my gosh! I pressed B? I did. I did. Okay. Because I clearly, like, fat thumbed that one. Burn damage, though. Oh, wow. Look at that. I just completely, like, fat-thumbed it. Done. Okay. No thank you. Ooh, one damage. Not bad. Here we go. Fat-thumb time. You know, I don't like that one. As much as I like a lot of the, um... The little attacks, that one's just too, I can get it wrong, <laughs> you know? All right, and then I also, if I'm gonna be using Vivian, I have to start learning what her little stylish timing is whenever she's like gonna deck him with the fire fist. All right, that's some good coinage right there. I kinda wanna beat these guys up, but they seem to be only one experience point per, so I'm gonna opt to not. Okay, so one of the other things that we did sh see a little bit earlier, remember all those buzzy beetles? Yeah, those buzzy beetles is where we have to go because there was that one uh, that one door that we kind of pushed all the way to the right and then like we couldn't we couldn't disappear with bow, like I said a little bit earlier in the stream. 
So that's unfortunate. Give me a give me a crazy daisy, man. Oh my gosh. An amazing daisy, I mean. Nada. Alright, let's try this. Oh, Stylish is right when she comes all the way back. I could press the A button right when she's next to Mario. Okay, just figured that out. Great. This is a- this is bad news. Like, this is real bad news. I don't think this is worth doing. I'm gonna veil. Oh, I have to- I have to do an input. Oh, you guys better run! That was cool. Totally worth it. What? Great. It's not even worth it. I can't even do the damage. Where's my Where's my D down P up badge, dude? I need down D down P up. Someone tell me where the nearest D down P up badge is because I need to do way more damage than this if I want to get these fools. Tossing some shade. Burn the daisy. Find another amazing daisy? I don't think so. I had one shot at it. And I did not practice my daughter's multi bonk enough. That's gonna hurt. Oh my gosh, that hurts so much. That was good. Since I'm in danger, I do way more damage. Yes. Absolutely. Thank you. Needed that. Oh, very good. Very good. That was the fastest and easiest battle ever. Totally worth it. All right. So I'm in danger mode right now. Let's go in here. Let's do our zip through here. Oh, look, you're back. I'll fight you guys again. I can get uh, 30 experience. If these guys are all back here, do you know how much experience that is? Oh my goodness! You realize how much experience this is. Here we go. Oh my gosh, do you know? I don't think you guys even know. I'm gonna get another level up and that equals three more badge points. So why wouldn't I? It's experience time, ladies and gents. Although I could use a hot dog right now. Because I got a couple Quake hammers that I can deal. <laughs> Riverside Station. Oh my gosh. Vivian, come on, don't get hit. Oh my gosh, what happened to me? Yet, yeah, provided that I can just Quake Hammer these guys really, really easily, I can do some work. Yo, the little Luma right there.
That's right, who's gonna be member number 1000? <laughs> That's awesome. Parker is our latest member. Dang, he's been on there for a little bit. Good job, Park. Welcome. Oh, they were saying fire doesn't affect them. Right, so if I were to do a fire punch... Yeah, it doesn't... it does no damage. Oh, dang, they're about to hit me with rocks! Ruthless! Yeah, here we go. Look, check this out. Although, I don't even want the experience, to be honest. I like being in danger mode right now. And also, can one of you guys tell me when Chet Rippo comes? Like, the guy that takes away your HP and gives you more, like, badge points or something? And what's up, Spring Killian Brooks? Hey! What's going on? I remember reading your name a couple of times. Hello! Thanks so much for hanging out. Welcome. There we go, excellent work. Yes, absolutely. Thanks for cheerleading that. You guys are awesome, welcome. I kinda wanna eat a hot dog. All right, beautiful. I have like 97 right now, like what? Look, I'm able to push it by jumping too. Yo, member number a thousand, nice, way to go. I just need one more battle, and then I got this extra badge points. What am I gonna do with all the badge points, though? I could put some things on that I took off. Oh, beautiful. Danger Mario, though. Mamma mia! Here we go. Ooh, look who where I am. That's uh, burritoable, because that's a word. You can burrito over there. And I knew something was gonna be over there. Yo, I absolutely did. Sometimes you have a feeling. After chapter five on Chet Rippo, thank you. All right, you remind me when the time comes, okay? You're in charge. You got a Mr. Softener, hey. And that's a bird. And oh my gosh! Boost Mario's jump and hammer attacks but I got a power plus! Yes! <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! I need more badge points though! I can go get rid of defend plus and go hyper offensive. You see my eyes light up? Last stand power rush, last stand power plus. I need like one level up. Can I can I guy just get the level up? Next level up, I swear. Here we go. Good morning. Good morning. Pretty bird. Pretty bird. Shine get. Shine get. <laughs> shine get. <laughs> you got the letter P. Oh, yeah. We needed that for the Duplass, dude. And I got the steeple key. Okay. The key that opens the door to the... St okay. I don't remember a locked door. I don't remember walking past the locked door in the steeple area. Yo, I just got power. Oh, never mind. Here it is. <laughs> okay. Oh, man. Welcome. Welcome. Uh, Jessica, I did not see if you upgraded your membership. I didn't see any pop up on that, unfortunately. But if you did, thank you, if that's the case. What did you upgrade to? Remember, beginning of June, we're going to do the VIP, the Superstar VIP, um, everyone into like a giant Zoom call, and we all hang out for a little bit. So make sure you uh, join in on that. If any of you guys are interested, by all means. It's gonna be like June 3rd? I think we're gonna do June 3rd or June 4th. I got a lot of things happening at like... The very end of uh... May. And then going into June 1st and June 2nd. I got a lot of things planned. Uh, so we'll do it directly after that. Alright, please fight me. Yeah. Okay, how about... Nyah! There we go. I just need this right now. I'm gonna get that Power Plus badge. And we're going to destroy you guys. 
How much power points do I have? Oh my gosh, that hurts. Why did you do that? One power point? Oh, that's not going to be good. Um, hmm. How do I do this? How do I do this? Softener? Hmm. They're going to put me to sleep. You know what? I... I have to do this. Unless I use clock out. No, no, forget that. What the what's the point of clock out? When you could just attack them. I haven't done this in a while. So let's see what's up. Yeah! I <laughs> love it. I'm a Luigi, number one. All right, let's go. You're gonna get punched. Get ready to get decked, kid. <laughs> See ya. All right, that's the experience that I needed, and now I get everything back, and some badge points, and I get stronger. Level up. All right, so now the question is, do I do F HP, or do I do FP and badge points. What do you guys think? Did you guys enjoy me like trolling you guys about getting F HP or is that getting old? <laughs> it's never gonna get old. Um, anyway, six badge points needed. I need three to, uh, to step up. I just want, I just want like another level up, please. FP plus, I need that. Last stand simplifier helps. Like all this stuff I need. Power plus P, I don't necessarily need my partner is to be that strong, but it does help. Damage dodge quake hammer is really good. <sighs> Power bounce, multi bounce. Multi bounce, I don't feel I need, cause I have quake hammer, so that's one. I don't know, man. Like, I, I don't feel like... You know, how about this? Let's just get rid of Defend. And I'll just put on Power Plus. And then now I got two to throw on something else. Um, FP Drain seems pretty good. It lowers my attack by one. But I get some FP back. And I'm really struggling on FP. Last Stand P is decent. Charge P is okay. If the boss is coming over here, maybe I should go... Oh, Happy Heart's also really good for health. But I don't want to be out of danger range. So maybe I go charge. Charge and close call. Yeah, charge and close call. Let's go. Okay, so I'm not as impervious as, as before, but the next level up I get, the next level up I get will be involving me giving that like that boost in defense one more time. So that's exactly my plans for that. So, here we go. If only I got that crazy daisy, man. Please show up. Four. Plus six. Yeah. I don't even need to quake hammer this guy. I'm just going to slam him. The bam bam a jamma right here. Okay, maybe I do have to do that. But punch him. For one damage. That's beautiful. Even if I got an HP plus badge, it wouldn't even be worth the uh, the badge points. I wouldn't dare waste the badge points if I had the HP plus badge. It's too defensive of an option. We're going hyper offensive here. Wasting si Oh my! Rematch time, baby! Let's go! Let's go! Here it is! Here it is! Oh my gosh, do not even talk to me. I can't tattle it either. Alright, alright, here we go. That's all I can do. Whoa, that's nothing! I can't do anything against that! I, that's not, uh, no way, man. No way. Unless I somehow time out? That's the tactic I needed to do to time it out. 
Can I try again? Can I try again? Can I try again? Can I actually try again? Hold on, hold on. Oh, I, I exited the area. Should I not have? Mamma mia. I should not have exited the dang area. That was a misplay. No. No. All right, all right, all right. You know what? I should not have done that. But, if I know about RNG, if I know a little something about RNG, this thing's coming back. I don't know the odds, but if you can walk away from the battle, if you can walk away from the battle, drop two coins, and re-roll to get the Amazing Daisy, you'd be a fool not to. Case in point. I don't know how to do this. When A, B, or X appears over the enemy, tap that button. Appears over the enemy. Go to bed. What am I doing? Blow him up! Oh my gosh. Um, I need to do something. If he- if- if these two stupid dudes put me to sleep, that ruins my plan. So I'm gonna veil. Yeah, you better run. Okay. Okay. I- oh, mm, uh, mm, let's see, let's see, let's see. I don't know what one turn means. I don't know what this means. Let's see, let's see. Should I try it again? Or does this mean, like, as soon as my Mario's turn, Vivian's turn, and then that thing goes away, and then I get another Mario and Vivian turn? I don't know what this means. So... <sighs> if I do a jump... I can do maybe like 10 damage. Yeah, I don't know, man. I'm just gonna go for it, here we go. do anything else that's stronger. Use a Mr. Softener on it. You know, I'll use a Mr. Softener on it a little bit later. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When A or B appears over the enemy, tap that button. Uh, is that because you have a status ailment? What is that? That's trash. You, I don't want you to burn it. Because you can't have two status ailments or you can't use it twice in a row. Come on. And I don't have any more, I don't have any more, like, um, appeal power. It's because of the burn status. It's one of the two. It's one of the two, honestly. It's either... It's either you can't have a burn status and the slow status, or you can't use it twice. And I don't have the science to back it. 
Ah, uh, I thought I was so slick. I thought I was so slick in using that timeout. But now I'm going into this final battle over here. I'm going into this final battle without any single, um, without any star power. So that's a little unfortunate. I thought I was so slick and I thought we were going to get it, but no. What's up, Slick? Been waiting for you. Okay. So, let me ask you this. I know his name is Dupless. But, uh, how do you actually find out his name is Dupless? In the game. Like, do you go back to the village town and you talk to the people and, say, and you talk to the ravens again? What? What did you just say? It can't be. No, 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 no. Wow, 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 wow. I'm feeling faint. Aha, uh -huh, now it's our turn. Let's get your name and body back. Where would he go to hide? Uh, Kevin Wilson, hey, what's going on? Welcome. Good to have you. So the bird in the room where you found the P, oh, you use Vivian, got it. And then Vivian uh, then tells you, uh, or the bird actually talks about it. That makes sense. Ah, that totally makes sense. Okay, so where did the dude run to? Let's go find out. He probably ran back to his mansion. Luigi's mansion. It makes sense, right? Because, like, the game was telling you, oh, hey, like, go listen to the birds. And then that random bird was just there for no reason. Like, obviously, it made sense. Okay, 4 8, not bad. I could probably smash one of these Goombas. Not for 8 damage, though. These guys are turds. Still upset about that, man. I gotta do stylish moves all over the place in order to earn that appeal back. Are you kidding me? <laughs> what a joke. Oh, dang, I didn't realize I do eight. Oh, cool. Kevin Wilson, what's up? And Angela, hey! Angela's in the house. Welcome, welcome. Two brand new members coming on board. Thank you so much for being here. You guys are absolutely amazing. Thanks for hanging out. Welcome. Oh, dang it. Jennifer Stark. Whoa. All you guys. Thanks so much. I hope that you guys are really enjoying the content. Thank you. Truly. Truly, you guys are great. Thank you. Oh my gosh, I didn't realize why was a button. Okay. Oh, he's going Super Saiyan. Oh, you are too, huh? Oh, you're using a life shroom? You can't just eat a life shroom. Get out of here. Beautiful. Jennifer, welcome. Glad to have you. Everyone, Paper Mario emotes in the chat for our brand new members that just came on board. Yeah, big three member train. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Okay, he's going Super Saiyan. I kind of want to appeal. So let's do that. Hold on, hold on. Who's throwing what? Is that a gradual shroom? I'll take it. Or a slow shroom. Cool, cool, cool. Thank you. Uh, let's do this. We'll do... I'm sorry. Tactics. We'll do appeal. And then we'll do a Shade Fist. Big punch. In your mouth. M-O-U-F. Alright, good job. I just need, like, more badge points. I need more badge points. <laughs> Yo, soft resetting for the Amazing Daisy, though. Let's talk about that really quick. I kind of want to do it.
Not enough. Okay, and you just ran for the sake of running. Okay, great. Okay, let's keep going, let's keep going. What a long chapter, huh? Just when we thought it was over an hour ago. <laughs> the chapter's like, no, nah, but wait, there's more. We'll give you a little false ending here. I think it's clever, though. I, I really like the design of it. I'm fine with it. Oof, I clearly did that. Three hurts, man. I don't know if I could do this. I I can't do the stylish on her. I did it, I did it once, and then I've never been able to do it again. It's like. You press the A button right as soon as she comes back to Mario, but that I press that and it's already too late by the time I see it. Okay, our HP, seven, five. I mean, I can pay the 10. All right, fine. Begrudgingly, I'll pay it. I think that heals should be free at all times, but. Rockhawk reminds you of the Ultimate Warrior in WWF? Hmm, interesting. Maybe that's what I had to do right there. Hold on. I gotta go back upstairs to Duplice's area. Maybe. That's where I'm assuming I have to go. You dumb bird. Look. What happened to the weirdos who were just here? Oh, whatever. It was almost nice to have some company. I mean, no matter how important it is that no one knows his real name. Locking me up in here just because I know it. And making me guard the name's stupid missing letter. No way to treat a parrot. I really want to take a cracker. Dupliss! You're a big meanie. When's feeding time, huh? <laughs> so, uh, uh, pretty bird, pretty bird. So that's exactly how you do it. Thanks for informing me on that one. An oversight, but I already knew the kid's name. Hmm, we heard it, we heard it, you little birdie. Dupliss, that's his name. Now let's get your name and body back from that meanie, and we'll teach him a lesson or two while we're at it. Vivian, have you not been paying attention? Because we've just done that. <laughs> it's just like scripted stuff. They're like, oh, we weren't expecting you to know Dupliss's name, having the power of the internet, on just common knowledge, apparently. I can't do anything against these guys, besides this. Yo, that guy's got a fire- OH MY GOSH! I would've loved it if that KO'd both of them. I can't do the stylus for my life! I can't do the stylish for my life on that one, man. I did it once, never doing it again. Oh, look at that, they dropped a fire flower for me. That's nice, thank you, I could use that. Okay, so I'm gonna press this once. Yeah, Dupless though? Right, so there's only one Dupless in the Mario universe, right? Or is every enemy that looks like that considered a Dupliss? Where else is Dupliss even in a Mario game? Someone looked that up on the wiki, yeah? What's up, Noah? Haha, <laughs> Noah, this game is a classic gem. Keep having fun, man. Hey, thanks for watching. I hope that you're having fun along with. I'm having a blast in this game. It's just, it's really fun. It absolutely is. Yeah, I don't know what a Dupla Ghost is, but... So their species is called a Dupla Ghost, is that what you're telling me? And then where are Dupla Ghosts in? Hey, you again, Slick. You're pretty stubborn to follow me all the way here. Fine, fine, I see, I get it. Let's just put an end to this, shall we? 
All right, kids, put on your fighting gloves. Uh, woohoo, it's a me. Oh, sure thing, Mario. Oh no, we're right here with you. This creep couldn't take us on his own, so he teamed up with a shadow. So, so he teamed up with a shadow siren. Well, we certainly won't be letting him do anything to our little Mario. You're gonna taste the pain, Gonzalez style, shadow guy. Very good, my loyal ones. How dare this nameless nobody challenge the great Mario. Mario. The guy who stole your name and body is Mario? That means you're Mario? Yeah, actually. No, of course not. I can't believe it. All this time I was helping Mario, I feel like an idiot. What's going on here, huh? Fight with your girlfriend? Well, don't expect any sympathy, sympathy from us ghoulies. Uh-oh. Oh no, Goombella, my daughter! See, your friends ditch you because you don't have the charisma of me, Super Mario. Wait, what do you mean? Where is she? What, is I not supposed to press that? Um, hello? Oh my gosh, how in the actual world? No! Okay, good. No! Ow! No! Oh my gosh! Ow! <laughs> my daughter hurts so much! That hurts so much! Oh my gosh! Oh! 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 Yeah, how do you like that damage? Mario, I totally failed you! Ugh. Oh my gosh, help me! I'm, I'm sorry, sis. This Mario is the only person who's ever been kind to me. Mario, I'm fighting by your side from now on. I've, I've made my choice and I'm not turning back. Oh, thank goodness. I was about to say. Oh my gosh. Get burnt, kid. I kind of want to do a big, gigantic bounce on him. I kind of want to, but I don't have a life shroom. So there's that. I got to play on the safe side. Yo, big Mario, big boy! Hey, come on! That's three of those! Dang, that hurts. Dang, you're already down, girl! Oof, get burnt. Oops. Oh, Mario, sorry. Uh. Uh-oh. 4 hurts a lot. Oh my gosh. Yo, coming at you. <laughs> coming in hot. <laughs> You'll get punched! Yo, coming in hot though! I gotta bounce on ya. I gotta bounce on ya. Here we go, girl. Here we go. Bouncing on these. Whoa. Ooh, yeah. You like that? You like that? Oh, bouncing on these two, huh? Yeah, get him, get him. <laughs> oh, Mario, here. Forgive me. Ugh. Yo! Good, good block, good block, kiddo. I don't know what this is! 
Ow! Oh, oh my stop! What are you doing? <laughs> oh my gosh! I'm like legit screaming right now. <laughs> what is he doing? I've never used the kid to use to know what his attack was. <laughs> oh my gosh! Okay, we need to we need either either eat hot dogs or something, man. I'm screaming. What is your problem, you little turd burglar? Yo, that's Enjamin doing that work. You're my meat shield in the form of Vivian, my gosh! Oh man, look at that beefy level up right there. Give me that. You want some? Come here. I don't think so. Three hertz. Oh, not on Vivian. Not on Vivian. Yo, yo! Oh, two, huh? Okay, okay. Yo, Viv, I need you to do something, man. Oh, no. Oh. You need, like, a shroom. Or something. Oh, a super shroom. Yeah, yeah, you need to just eat it. Like, you don't do damage. Just eat that. I found it on the ground. I hope you like it. Vivian's my meat shielderson, so... Sorry, Andrew, man. Oh, Enjamin! Enjamin's still- Ow! Oh, hey! 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 You can't do that! Oh my gosh, stop! Power! Oh! 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 Oh my gosh! Yo, Viv, do some work! Viv, just- just do something! Alright, here you go. We're gonna go Veil, man. Do I get to attack as Mario? No, we just waste our turn? That's stupid. Look at how strong Enderman is! There's no point in even using Veil. Tell me you're done. Gonzalez, avenge me! Uh. She's dead. And what are you throwing? What are you throwing? A can? I don't think so. Punch him in the mouth. Alright, we need to do some work with Viv here. Like, she's gotta do something. So, here, just eat a shroom. You wanna eat a hot dog? Yeah, eat a hot dog. It's not pork, don't worry. Mmm, yummy. Okay, now let's do some work. I was so afraid. Wait, hold on. Dupless, can I do a jump on you? I don't want to waste my FP if I can't. Oh, I could have ended this a long time ago, huh? Four hertz, man. Four hertz. Alright, here we go. Enjoy the Mr. Softener. Minus three defense is going to be killer. Watch. Wait, why didn't I do even more damage than that? How much defense do you have? How dare you try to do this to the great Super Mario? How dare you? Oh, big dodge! Yo, peril. Yeah, um, I mean, we could eat a hot dog. You'll be fine. Eat a hot dog. She's just our hot dog eater. Resident hot dog eater and slash meat shield. So she's doing really well. I got full health of Mari Mar, so we're good. Grack, I almost had it. Super Mario's hurting. No thanks? Oh, get punched. He's got some defense. <clears throat> Let's just finish him off with style, shall we? Extra credit. Take that for making me beat up my friends. No, why? How? 
Oh my gosh, how exciting was this chapter? 20 experience. What about all the experience I get for beating up my partners? Like, shouldn't I get like 100 experience now? Huh? I love bouncing on Flurry, that was the best part. Extra padding. <laughs> oh, rats! You kill Joys? What? He ran away. I mean, wait, just what the heck is going on here? That wasn't the real Mario? Did we get shell winked? How could I ever mistake my dear Mario for another? Oh, silly flurry. So who's this girl, huh? Isn't she one of the shadow sirens you guys mentioned? Why would Gonzalez pair up with one of those creeps? Well, I, uh... Pokemon, thank you. Pokemon anime battles. Hey, thanks. Oh, Mario, thanks for sticking up for me. Well, thanks to her, I guess, you came through. It's okay, no sweat, right? Uh, listen, Mario, sorry about earlier. I'd be happy to travel with you if you'll have me. Vivian has really joined your party now. This is for you. You got a crystal star. Your star power is now five, and you learned Art Attack. Art Attack. Whoa, watch out for art. Your favorite subject. Okay, so now is this the real end of the chapter? No more fakes? We good here? Can I actually save and end the stream? Mario defeated the rogue who had stolen his name and appearance. Now Mario has four crystal stars. That leaves a mere three more to find. And that means uh, his quest to collect all the crystal stars is more than half over. Now Mario heads off towards his next adventure with his new friend, Vivian. But what about Beldum and Marilyn? And what became of the doppelganger Dupless? Save the game progress at this point? Yes, we will. Yes, we will. Okay. GG's. We've actually done it. Okay, so now I'm not going to do like a fake ending. I know some of you guys, uh, some of the people actually left the stream right when I was doing my little end card thing, but... <laughs> Stinks for them. Alright, Noah, hey, thanks for watching. Alright, okay, so in case you guys have not seen on the channel... We're doing Paper Mario Marathon up to the next one, which is Paper Mario the Origami King. Join up with that. It's going to be super fun. It's going to be on the 16th of July. Yahoo. It'll be great. So make sure you guys are all subscribed. Thanks for watching. You guys are awesome. I'm going to go take a breather. And then uh, we'll see you possibly tomorrow for even more Paper Mario. What did you guys like about this chapter? Let me know. It was such an amazing chapter. Oh my gosh. These 10 HP strats are killing it, and we got so many badge points. I can't wait. I really want to just, like, go into the shop and, like, get more of those last stand badges and just keep on going. Just keep going, man. Anyway, you guys are awesome. We'll see you guys later. Thanks so much for watching, and uh, don't forget to turn on notifications so you know when we go live with all of these live streams. Shoutouts to our four new, four plus brand new members. We had a whole bunch of members. Uh, how many members did we have today? Let me click on refresh to find out. I had a whole bunch of you guys. Thanks so much for coming. We boosted right back up over a thousand members. Thank you for being there. And yeah, we'll see you on the next one. Make sure you guys take a look at all that stuff. Playlists, fun stuff. There's a lot of things happening on my channel. Yo, 18 new members today? Holy moly. Is that right? Wow. Dang, you guys are awesome. Thanks so much for the support. We'll see you on the next one. Take care.